Oh, 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 boy. Oh, I don't know if you guys are ready for this. Ooh-wee. Mmm. Let me hear ya. AMS, baby, let's do it. It's 7 o'clock. Hello, my name is Matt Malone, and I stream iRacing. Now, uh, you guys, if you forgot, iRacing is a browser-based game. Open up your favorite browser. Mine's Microsoft Edge. Install the extension called Honey. And we can get real sticky together. TJ Hilly, welcome. Dave DeGroot. Free wheel and B sticks, Dylan Apex Bloom, Deja Vu, making it Wayne. Bowling for soup, the cowboy. Ooh, 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 the mad golfer, Mr. Mike Techno, the Viking. Matt's 1990 Noor. DW. Oh, ho, ho. oh boy. Funky Krusty Spaceman's here. He's ready for it. Dun, dun. Ah, oh, oh, oh. There it is. Whoa. Hey, you can read the chat. Can you read your chat? Whoa, crazy. Ooh. Look at that in all its glory. Look at that, huh? We'll be using it a little bit later. Listen, I, I got a big race coming up, guys. When's the McLaren wheel raffle? Ha 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 you're crazy. Dude, check this out though. Look how clean. Look how clean. So clean. Ooh. It, it's, it doesn't have all my boogers on it yet. No boogers. No boogers. Look at these, look how big, look at these things. Look at these things. Like your clutches and stuff. How clickety clackety is it? Well, if you guys saw my video, exclamation point wheel, that microphone really picked up a lot, and it, and I was like, I don't know, it it's very muted. It's I hate the clicky stuff. Ace Attack's really good about it too, but if you get like a it's a, it's a little clicky, but man, it feels good. It's me, it's a muted click, you know? Well, if you had the game running, you probably wouldn't hear it. Oh, we'll find out later, I guess. But yeah, clean, dude. What is Asher Racing? They make uh, sim wheels and stuff. I like high-end stuff. Ooh. So yeah, pretty cool, huh? Yeah, dual clutch. I haven't really never set up dual clutch on anything. <laughs> it's more of a clerk. Yeah, it's not a click. It's a clerk. So how you guys doing, man? Uh, yeah, Maddie Gwill. So apparently, if you go on their website, when you order it, you can... I'm sure you can buy a quick release from them or just have one. No, 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 because this one has the integrated USB-C. Well, let's go to the website. Let's see. Because, yeah, it's a different quick release than what I have at home for my other ones. Uh, and I think they have, like, third-party sellers as well. Wheel type. Here you go. Oh, no. USB shipping from week 18. Oh, here you go. Without wheel side quick release. I don't know what that is. With Ace Attack Invicta for Asher Racing Wheel side quick release. With Chaffinch. Don't know what that is. With Simicube 2 QR. So there you go. Yeah, you can choose. I don't know. Does it come with a McLaren? Uh, yes. I got mine, uh, where is mine anyway? Oh, oh, oh. oh okay. <laughs> okay, I screwed this scene up, apparently. <laughs> uh, hold on, some of the immersion is broken.
Whoopsie daisies. Uh, yeah, that, that, that's, uh, the, uh... Yeah, I was gonna pull out one of the, uh, Ferraris and pull in my McLaren. Okay. <laughs> I screwed that scene up. Oh, wait, hold on. I wanted to do this. There we go. Oh, just wait till we get the race scene. I don't know, uh... I gotta fix the race scene once we get in. I haven't loaded in. All right, let's get in there. Whoops. Not time attack. Leagues! My league! Sessions. Here we go. Let's get in there. Guys, tonight, we will crown an AMS champion for 2024 Season 6. Kev B 2009 Thanks for the eight months, man. I appreciate that. Mental Vision, good to see you. Oh, you're on vacation. Nice, man. Hey, Plain, plain Integral, welcome. Thought I clicked on join. That's right, Miller. <laughs> I broke the illusion, Mr. Mike. Uh, so right now I'm fourth on the standings. Let's pull up the standings. Uh, yes, right here. Make it bigger. There we go. So, Aeronom is leading 360. Jack Sanchez. Hi, Good luck tonight. Only nine points away to the champion. Fabian Zweier. I gotta get him to... How did he say his last name? Uh, he's at 338 points. And Matt Malone, 332. So a top top three is... De uh, like, a podium position is definitely in the cards for me. Something really bad would have to happen to some of these top guys for me to win the championship. But, I mean, you never know. So, yeah, it's pretty tight here. I mean, Arrow does not have this in the bag. I mean, it's between, it's between Arrow and Jack, I would say. And maybe Fabian. But... If you understand, baby one a.m. But him looped up in baby oil on my waterbed, ready for some Mustang racing. I should ignore that. <laughs> yep. <laughs> oh. <laughs> now I see Merle coming in. Merle dropping a tier two. Oops. Uh, Merle, the f Mo hold on, Blizzard. More <laughs> Merle. Thanks for that tier two, man. That's unbelievable. And two hundred bits from Blizzard. Thanks, man. <laughs> So basically, Randy Daytona coming in with eight. Thanks, buddy. So really, it's a fight between Arrow and Jack, for sure. The way the points work is that, like, if Arrow, maybe if he got, like, I mean, he's, it's almost like you, ha you almost have to crash out to not gain any points. But, uh, yeah, it's tough out there. But anyway, so, yeah. Let's see here. All right, let's fix this scene. <laughs> yeah, DJ. Yeah, like if 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 the top five in points get top five in the race, but just in a different order, it's probably gonna stay the same. You know, like there has to be a big mix-up. Okay. Oh, you know what? I turned off my steering wheel. Don't worry, we're gonna fix this scene. Okay, oh, it looks like I'm using this. Yeah, see guys, I'm using the new McLaren rim. Yep, I'm using it. <clears throat> Just kidding. 
You can tell how much prep I do for uh, streams, huh? Uh, put this over here. So it's all together in a nice, happy family, huh? There we go. Yeah, just cover the screen even more with stuff. All right. The link's in German? Yeah, if you do Google Translate, you can get it to speak English. I think you can buy it through uh, other... They have, like, third-party places. I can maybe find that out. The screen's starting to look like a NASCAR jacket. <laughs> I'm doing some sponsored streams for Asher, trying to promote their new wheel. I don't know if you guys saw my video. So, it's a five-stream deal. So, it'll be over by the end of the month. But, uh... We... I will use the wheel. I just can't risk it for uh, this, for this uh, big race. So, but we got it on screen, you know. I can't wait to use it. Actually, the um, the the buttons on it. It's a gr it's a great idea where each button is like laser etched. There's a shit ton of them too. And they all got different uh, symbols on them, and then the light shines through. Now, Jack gave me this setup, and he told me to watch out for a couple things, but... Yeah, Asher Wheels, uh, yeah, Asher Wheels been in the game for a while. Couch Slouch, welcome. in a couple things. Car on. Clear. Oh, there's arrow. We'll follow him. Yeah, so, yeah, Asher makes the McLaren uh, rim for the race car, the GT4 car, in the real world. Surprised you didn't know that. Hmm. I'll put it here. I'm fine. <laughs> yeah. A lot of pre-planning goes into a lot of my streams, guys. I, uh, I'm sure you caught on to that. Tell Quirk that Daddy's here, huh? I thought Quirk was streaming. Hey, let's start a petition to get Quirk uh, to do AMS next season, huh? Huh? He can handle this thing. He can handle it. I don't think he likes slow cars, <laughs> to be honest. <laughs> Jakubis, what's up? Yep. We can ask him. Woo. Yeah, Cork is streaming right now, yeah. No, no, no. Don't ask him now. No, no, no. Next season. Drux TV. Thanks for the first time sub, man. I appreciate that. Welcome to the gaggle, my friend. Hope you enjoy yourself. 
Hey, I should say, I should say that there is a tornado watch in my area. So if Reed Timmer shows up, we may lose power. So yeah, if the stream cuts out at any moment or if we have issues, it's because there's bad weather in my area. Just so you know. Oh, this is my favorite track. I can't get the music right. That's out. There's hot local singles in my area. Are you kidding me? OHS Tinky Poop. Ha 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 ha. Poopies. Funny poopies. LLLLA. Ha ha. Funny poop. Poop funny. We ha ha yay. For poopy good poopy poopy. Funny. Ha 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 ha. Poop 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 poop. Funny yay. Fun fun poop. He. He. Clear. It's my balloon in the server. Here we go. Matt Malone's here. You know, it's real poopy, real bad. Checkers. What's up, buddy? <laughs> it just kept going. 104 months for checkers. Are you kidding me? He's a moderator here. Did you guys know that? Oh, yeah. He's been banning people for 104 months. Actually, the channel's pretty well behaved. He's probably... He could probably count on one hand how many people he's banned. <laughs> I think he bans more bots out of the Discord than anything. <laughs> What's up, checkers? I subscribed for six months in advance. You did? Legend. I am not worthy. Checkers is having a good time. It's AMS. He's going to be up there tonight. I can feel it. He was charging last week at Lagooner. All right, let's go for a hot lab next. What does a fence sitter mean? It means somebody that can't make a damn decision. Be out front with it. And just be like, just, just tell me. It's like, oh, I don't know. Oh. Oh, maybe this way, maybe that way. Oh, I don't know. Make a damn decision. Stick with it. Right or wrong, you know what I'm saying? Don't worry about me. I'm going to No, I'm not a fence sitter. Sometimes. No, I'm more of a sideline guy. Go ahead, Mike. La Prima gear in Canada? Are you telling me... Clear on the left. You can't buy a La Prima and have it sent to Canada? I don't know. I'm sure they want to sell it to you. No, this setup's good. Jack gave it to me. Getting in. Six Sigma Racing in Canada. There you go. Yeah, a lot of these companies have to use third party wholesalers or whatever. Sim Racing carries Ace Attack now? Who, who's carrying Asher? That's what I want to know. Guys. 
This stream sponsored by Asher. <laughs> this deck's good, too. It's all good. We're all spoiled, huh? We're all spoiled. You spoiled, rotten little sim racer, you. Advanced sim racing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Slugger's spoiled. He's a tier four subscriber. I'm spoiled. That was your box of lack of obsession. Tenth. All right, we can work on that. Something to work on. Nematode, good to see you, man. Hey, Freak71. I'm glad you're here. It's okay, Alex. I love you anyway. Not as equally slugger, but you know. No. <laughs> Dude, finishing out AMS on the mountain, unbelievable. I tell you, Finny McFinger should like... He could make a living just creating schedules for cars. <laughs> He really picks him right. I know he intimately knows the Mustang, so I mean, certain cars sh suit different tracks, you know? It is like a roller coaster. It's like riding a roller coaster, but you are the carny. Mm -hmm. that is a third gear corner I got to get the right turn in speed getting going through there Thank you. another heater <laughs> up to seventh now Can't say Carney anymore. No, no, no. They're not taking that from us, are they? Who's they? Guys, listen. They is us. If we decide we can use Carney, we can use it. People with small hands. You know what, Squatch Moto? I may have got that information wrong on the video. I believe this particular wheel that I have is not wireless. It's only USB, but there are other Asher wheels that, if, you, if you're on their website, it has a little symbol, like a wireless symbol and a USB symbol. Some of the wheels have both symbols. <laughs> they may release this wheel in both wireless and USB as well. But I believe I did make that mistake. But on the website, it should tell you. Oh. Jesus. Carney, 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 Carney. Good Lord! Leave it! Oh my God! Looks like your car is towed. You'll need a tow back to pit lane. Press and hold the reset button and we'll come and get you. Is he okay? I am not okay. I repeat, I am not okay. <laughs> Had a wall 20 minutes. <laughs> yeah, more like, yeah, 20 days. Nice shirt. Oh, yeah, the TK one. Fuck, I had to look. Ow! Let's see exactly what happened there.
Hey, Adam Bloom, what's up, dude? Thanks for the 16 months. Splee TV, thank you, buddy. Now, who hit me? That's what I want to know. Who hit me? Oh, jeez. Hey, he hit me on purpose. <laughs> oh, my gosh, dude. I haven't seen a Mustang that wrecked in a while. That's what made it so funny was the entire cast losing it. Hold on a second. I didn't hit you on purpose. I just uh, was on a hot lap, and I was praying you would so in time. Hold on a second. Okay, checkers. You guys are talking about the Beavis and Butthead SNL skit from last weekend. No, it's not funny that all the characters break character. That's not what makes it funny. See? No. No, 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 no. I disagree. They call themselves actors and comedians. They can't even keep a straight face. Come on. Right side. Clear. Right side. Sometimes when they Clear. break character, it has to be like really small and like it can't be the entire skit, you know? Yeah. If they would have pulled it off, maybe it would be funny, but most of the time. SNL's really gone downhill, but yeah. I guess it depends on who's breaking character, but it's like... Yeah, that's actually a big criticism with SNL is they can't hold it together because they're all drinking. And that's what I've been told. I wasn't told that, I heard it, but who knows. But they've, they've kind of always done that in years always break character you know but I feel like nowadays it's like every skit what's my favorite comedy movie mm, Wizard of Oz That's true, Zahn, or not. Nostalgia affects people's criticism, or like, you know, they have favoritism because of it. I mean, SNL didn't get any better. I mean, you'll know, you'll know my generation. When it was like Adam Sandler, Chris Farley, Tim Meadows, David Spade, all of them, you know? That, that stuff was hilarious, but it was, it all depends on how old you are. Argent, what's up, man? That's yeah, true, Fuse. Like, my parents would say Dan Aykroyd and, um, not Buscemi, uh, Belushi and all that was good. And they had some good stuff, but not bad. they can only, they can only name me, like, three skits that were good, you know? Like, oh, the Bassmaster one is so I'm funny. Like, okay, that's one. <laughs> yeah, Steve Martin. Celebrity Jeopardy was good, yeah. <laughs> Thanks, brother. Yeah, Norm. Doing update. Bashing on OJ. <laughs> right, I like the, uh, the woman joke. He like reads an article. He's like something about like women can't drive in traffic, and they're like, ooh. And they're like, yeah, I'll have you know that article was written by a woman. And they're like, ah. And then he's like, something like, just kidding. <laughs> it was by a man. <laughs> and he kept going back and forth. It was pretty funny. I guess he had to be there. Oh, as far as comedy movies, though, I don't know. I grew up with, like, Jim Carrey stuff, so... Dumb and Dumber and Ace Ventura. Are big. Tommy Boy's great.
There's Sanchez right in front of me. Is Jack Sanchez your future AMS champion? Or will Aeronom hold on to take the trophy? Find out in one hour, right here. <laughs> David Hasselhoff? Yeah, Germans do love him. If Arrow, Jack, and Fabian both wreck out the very first lap and I win the race, I guess maybe it's possible I could win the championship. <laughs> but I don't want, I wouldn't want that to happen. Left side. Keep to the right. Clear. Here's what happens when you use the other guy's brake pads. So the, the thing I got going for me, any penalty worthy of a drive through will have a 20 second time added. Oh boy. Yeah, there's no like next race penalties for this because this is the last race, so it's gonna be interesting. Um, it's my favorite track. Um, I have a very intimate relationship with this track in a very non, but also very sexual way. No. This could be definitely considered my favorite combo in all of iRacing. And this is also the combo that broke floppy. You guys remember that? I broke my Fnatic rim years ago on this track during AMS. But you know a rim that you'll never Don't break? That. You are the mountain. Is the Asher. Ultimate sim racing rim. Eh, what do you think? Uh-oh, uh-oh. Might have blew the motor. Gotta pump it. Do I have to poop now? Yeah, I was miss shifting. For some reason, I couldn't get it in gear or whatever. Coming down the mountain. Or after the Falcon corner. I know, Puff. Isn't that crazy? Now I have too many rims. Literally. GSI or Asher? Well, they're different. I've never tried an F1 style rim from uh, GSI, but. Good save, good save. You can grab. Yeah, all those top end rims are pretty nice. Do I like my... Well, I haven't even tried the Asher rim, guys. <laughs> I'm just looking at it and feeling it, and the paddles are nice. I mean, the Asher rim is probably better than my GSI, yeah. What? Still going. Maybe a good comparison right. video if somebody there. made that. So the Asher wheel is very compatible with a lot of different wheel rims. Because it's like straight USB. And there's something with Fnatic where you gotta put in a like a dummy plug. Cause freaking Fnatic, you know how they are. They have like proprietary force feedback and like 
if you plug something in a certain way, it, it recognizes. It's kind of like back in the day with like NES. And you had to get like that special thing to put in the console before you put in the game. So it would like trick the game or trick the console. Because something was like region yeah, blocked or something. 25 minutes away from that awesome driver the last one of the season. I'll give you another warning here. But... So if you want to check out, his channel's called lovely sim racer lovely dashboard sim racer lovely something lovely sim racing he's done a bunch of videos on the asher rim recently since it came out and he's talked about the fanatic plug yeah this is a heater because of the draft <laughs> i forget what it is matt if someone finds it you can link it but he's been putting out a bunch of videos this is kind of a smaller channel, so you may not have heard him, but if you're interested in the Asher stuff, he seems very knowledgeable. You've got the fastest lap. Oh, boom! I'm the best, I'm the best. Overtake him in practice to assert dominance. Oh, okay, Dupin Fire. That makes sense. I saw some stuff on it with the KW branding. Oh, you found it. Sweet. Thank you. Yeah, check it out. Because, yeah, Asher doesn't make wheel bases. So they make wheel rims. And they make dashboards. So like, yeah, of course they're going <laughs> to make it as compatible as possible, you know? Dude, the integrated USB-C cord that I'm using for, for, uh... Oh, shit. Fucking Jack, you put me right into the wall! Is, uh, something I wish I had for the GSI and my MPI rim. It's literally just a USB-C coming out of the, the quick release and a USB-C right into the back of the wheel. Where the quick release, uh, connects to. And you just get one of those little like, or it comes with it. If you get, if you get the Ace Attack quick release with your Asher rim, it give you a little USB cord, and you just plug it in, dude. And it's like seamless. It's amazing. Wish I had that. So you don't have that big coiled, uh, coiled uh, cable like I do for the GSI and my MPI. But I guess GSI is working on uh, integrating it all and all the different quick releases as well. Jimmy doing something with that? No, he's with Moza, I thought. I'm just doing a quick little five stream thing for Asher. Just doing something for their uh, new rim that they got. These people have been waiting for it for a while. It was at Sim Racing Expo and everything, so. Alright, let's pretend. Me and Jack were leading the race. He pulled into the pits. And now I'm going to throw down a heater and pit. Right? We're in the heat okay, of the battle. Jay, you'll live another day. Sorry. I thought that was Nick. 69,000 follower celebration on Twitch? Where are we at? I have no idea. Thanks for your understanding. Follower count on Twitch doesn't seem like... Yeah. That son of a gun. 67k followers on Twitch. Maybe Jimmy did something with Asher, I have no idea. Bedroom tour. <laughs> oh, Jack warned me about that. Curb. Jack, 
20 minutes until the final driver meeting of the season. I know it's Dave Moore's favorite part of the evening is probably yours too. See you at 20 minutes in this course. You know what, Icky? I was wondering, me and Samantha were watching Jimmy's videos, and she's like, why is it blurred out? I'm like, oh, it's probably just a smudge on the camera. And she's like, no, it's like a perfect square. I'm like, oh, I'm like, telemetry? I'm like, I don't know. But yeah, that makes sense. Nailed it. Pit box team, 10. No, because Fnatic sponsors like entire race series in real life. They sponsor like so much stuff, dude. No wonder why they're freaking can't pay their loans. <laughs> they're spending all their money on advertisement. Yeah. <laughs> You okay, Jack? I mean, think about it. Like, when you watch a real-life race, they have the yeah, entire yeah, front yeah, banner the of the car that says Fanatic. I mean, do you realize how much money that price they probably spend on that? Anyway, but yeah, I don't know. You board the screen, not the wheel, right? I don't know. It's just a tax write-off. <laughs> Hey, Bister. No, no, no. We're doing, um... No, no, no. Asher, talk to Ace Attack. It's all fine. We're just doing a quick little five stream thing just to promote their new wheel. Which is, uh, pretty badass, I'd have to say. We'll use it later, but I can't, I can't risk using this rim with this race. You know what I'm saying? So if you haven't seen the video yet, exclamation point wheel. Go check it out. This thing's clean, dude. Yeah, so here's a great example. So right here, if you have like a I different... shifted in the first and didn't lose the motor. That if you have amazing. a different type of uh, quick release or however you're hooking it up to like different, different wheel bases and stuff, then you would use the regular coiled USB cord. Um, but the US, there's a USB-C cord in here. Comes out from the middle. It's actually pretty genius. Yeah, it's not a cheap rim. It's sick, though, man. Because if you go to the website, you can see their other ones. It's just kind of blank. It's just kind of blank, and some of them have the rotary knobs, but otherwise, it's like... <laughs> you see this, You see the wheels, and you're like, oh, they should put a screen in the middle. <laughs> well, they finally did, so... Not that everybody likes the screen, but it really... Aesthetically speaking, it does bring the whole rim together. Compatible with Ace Attack? Yep, it's right on there. This is the Ace Attack quick release. You betcha there, buddy. All right. Radical. Yeah, I've heard people use like the Asher, the Asher uh, Pro or something that doesn't have a screen, and then Asher makes a, a, a screen, so then you set that up because. Yeah, I get it. Like, not a lot of people like to have a screen, like, on their wheel because it's much closer to, like, you're not looking at it, you know? But you get those sim dashes, and those can sit pretty close. You basically m try to mount it, like, up against your screen or whatever. And so people will do that, but... All right. Oh, nice. Autism racing. Daryl. Hey, there he goes. There goes, there goes Black Clear. Dog. Let's get him. That's true, Mid-East Beast. What about that one wheel rim? I forget who was going to make it, but it had, it was like a, uh, I want to say, uh, not Rolls Royce, a Bentley. It was a Bentley rim that had like that thing in the middle. And it was on like a gyro or something where like it would stay centered. It was Fnatic. Whatever happened to that? Whatever happened to that thing? Were they ever going to release it? It seemed really gimmicky, but 
I mean, it looked cool. I don't... I don't know how many that would sell, but... <laughs> it is a hell of a flex, though, I guess. But, yeah. Oh, ow, fuck. Yeah, the MPI wheel. <laughs> Moferator. Like, dude, I race in VR. Yeah, I know, but it's a it's a touch screen. And it's got all these cool options. Dude, I race in VR. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But the screen on the wheel is crucial. Uh, excuse me, do you know what VR is? <laughs> That's funny. <laughs> now, if you were using the Apple ProVision where it's like AR, that might be different. Yeah, it'd be nice to try stuff out first, right, Puff? Yeah. Is the Asher one a touchscreen? Yes. Yeah, when I was messing with it, making the video, I uh, loaded in. I just made a an AI practice session. Uh, McLaren GT4 at Spa practice server with AI, and all I did was just. Uh, get the Asher sim hub profile that they provide in the sim hub or whatever and just ran it as default And uh, it was all loaded up and everything and I'm in there and I just touched the screen because it's a touch screen And it went to the standings and the standing it has a whole screen just on standings. It was pretty cool I was like wow that was surprising so you can like Yeah, they built a pretty nice profile for it for sure Especially because I don't really know how to use SimHub. I'm going to be honest. I've tinkered with it. But, dude, it's pretty wild how much stuff you can do. And so it's nice that they provide a really nice profile for it. it just works right out of the box. Oh, man, do not hit that curb. Well, Asetek worked with uh, Asher with the uh, design with like the quick release and stuff for Asher wheel, so nah, it's all good. Oh, the touchscreen with gloves. It's a good point. Yeah, I guess you have to have gloves that have that special thing on it. Yeah, that's the one you want to wait rebounding when you hit it. Yeah, don't be like hard on the brakes when you hit it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You don't want to have the front of the car like tilted down as you hit it. <laughs> Go right. Car contact. I I have a pair of Maradness gloves, but I don't wear them. Maybe I should. I used them in the video just to try them out. I was like, yeah, and I was actually thinking when I put them on and I was messing around, I was like, yeah. I don't know, maybe I'll try them again. I, I, I don't know. They just seem a little cumbersome. Maybe it's just the Maradness gloves. Maybe they're just too big with the reverse stitching and, like, they're just... Maybe I need, like, tight gloves. Like, I know people, a lot of people wear, like, tight mechanic gloves. Yeah, 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 Bangler. Maybe that would make more sense. I wear a type of glove at work. It's like an anti-cut glove, and they're super tight, and they're a little grippy, and they're they're amazing. Like you have full like dexterity while having a glove, you know. You can't perform with a tight glove. Neither could OJ. Oh. Ow. Oh. I thought you stream eye racing. I do. <laughs> Looks like your car hey, don't goes. speak ill will of the, uh, Press and hold the reset button and we'll the come dead. And get you. Fabian says you just need a P4, P3 with a lead lap to take him. 
And if I if I beat him, so if I get, I I, I okay. Well, it's close. Yeah. We're, uh, yeah, I'm only six points off. I need to lead a lap, and I need to beat Fabian. So, like, what if I get? third and he gets fourth but I let a lap then I beat him probably the rubber dipped work gloves and they work with touch screen huh. oh he's not racing tonight oh, oh 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 so uh, we'd have to do the math because like it's using drops, so we would have to find out. Yeah, it's so he's. Yeah, you'd have to figure it out which uh, which is his worst performance. It's only two drop weeks, so interesting. Yeah, that's a lot of math. <laughs> if I just win, that'll be me doing my job. All right, let's do a quality run, I guess. You have about five laps of fuel left. I gotta turn my spotter down. Holy crap! Let me do it right now so I don't forget. Because I will forget. I thought I used to have a button for it. I can assign a button, but I forget which one it is. <laughs> Actually, the wheel came, the Asher wheel came with a, a whole sheet of stickers. And they're very universal stickers. I could, definitely could use them on my button box. I haven't noticed checkers. No sheet. I'm racing for a $20 jump in prize payout. Yeah, six points. He used one drop so far, so counting today, he's six ahead. Well, yeah, because when I look at the points, I'm six points away from Fabian. But that's accounting for two drops. So one of his drops will be this week. So we have to find out what his two other drops are and find out which one he scored more points in. Take that one and add it. And then find out what I got. You know what I'm saying? So tonight's going to count as a, as a drop for Fabian. But those points are already accounting for two drop drop weeks. So we got to find out what those two drop weeks are and then go from there. You're making it hard? Your penis? No. <laughs> you like when I talk math to you? What's the square root? What, what, what's the square root of pi? That's what... That's what killed Einstein. Couldn't figure it out. <laughs> you just have to score three more points than his second worst score. That's right. But seven points more than my best score. And 17 minus six for the preseason. Since I pitted early and, and led a lap, that way, I can be in the next season's playoffs, which will give me a four-point advantage on Arrow in 2027. See, I got it figured out. <laughs> <Okay>. <laughs> if you leave any time on the table, you won't get three laps. Oh, okay, good. That's good to know. Is 
Is this enough fuel for four laps? Yes. Hit quality and get on it. Okay. And 2.1 gallons is enough for the four laps, so... We, we did one pit stop. It's so horrible. That's right, Mikey. <laughs> the true McNugget. Thanks for the sub, buddy. Brian C., thank you. For the tan. the zone All right. clear on the right I'm gonna get that man in the spreadsheet I got it I get it to you maybe hard to read Shane Robinson, good to see you. But guys, I don't want... Look. Yeah, you say like, okay, you gotta do this, and you gotta do that, you gotta practice this, you gotta, oh, you gotta do good, get, get this in points, and do this. And you're like, okay, let's take a breath. Don't get your all don't get yourself all worked up. Just approach it. Like we always do, right? There's no need to make any crazy moves at the beginning. I mean obviously we need to qualify well, but you gotta be nice and calm to do so. Treat it like any other race. Be consistent. Take care of your tires. Save a little fuel. I think I think I think it, the fuel is definitely gonna come into play. So we we may just get a train. And just see, let the race come to us. Don't try to force anything. Uh, if I could think of any more cliches, I'd use them. You know, take it one race at a time. Take it one lap at a time. His worst two are 0 and 31. You got about two laps of fuel left. Okay. That's great information. So 31 points. I have to get 30... I'm six points away from him, so 37 points. How can I get 37... Oh, 38 points. Oh, so it's not a tie. <laughs> hey, if it's a tie, do I 1v1 him? <laughs> At Central Pedal Circuit, of course. <laughs> yeah, I gotta lead a lap. Well, how am I gonna get 37 points? like a lot maybe that's like second place or like third place maybe hey true mcnugget old mate howie we're not on the new rim yet i got it right here it's ready to go see we're gonna use it later i can't risk using a new wheel for this race Monty. Yeah. <laughs> the math is hard. Fourth place is 37 points. So if I get fourth place and I lead a lap, I, I get third overall. Or I beat Fabian. I think we just figured it out, Mikey. 
third place is 30. Well, let's just get third then. Yes, yes, Muloni. So if we get podium in this race, we get podium for the championship. That's a much easier way to say it, right? I think you get one point for leading lap. I mean, I could get pole position in quality. That's a point. Oh. Well, why didn't he... Re he oh, I... Fuck. Yeah. Sorry. So, okay. Sorry. I'm here. Sorry. All right. Welcome oh, to the wait. final round of season six. Beautiful mount panorama. Um, we normally do a post okay. jump. If you I screwed up because round. I muted um, the chat in game. We probably won't be able to make. And I was jump. waiting for him to. We're just going to yeah. do an end of the race pile up. Anyway, so if you have the fuel to make it back up the mountain at the end of the race, please, please make it to the breakaway there, and we will wait for everybody to gather and then do one big massive pile up. Now that the important business is out of the way, let's talk about the drivers. This is the actual drivers meeting. Um, please stay off the, the comms unless it's something very race specific. If you have a problem with a driver, keep it off comms. If you have a problem with somebody or an incident occurs, please file a protest. If you think it's worth any scrutiny at all, especially tonight, file a protest. Uh, I am going to reiterate that Thanks, we Dad, normally Sean. have a 24-hour window for protests. We'll be enforcing that this week for sure. Um, in overtaking situations, it is the overtaking driver's responsibility to facilitate the <laughs> If you pass second place, what position that are you in? Said, yeah. <laughs> the person being overtaken isn't absolved of all responsibility. If somebody has established a position alongside of you at the turning point, they are entitled to space, and you must give it some. The blue flag is informational only. If you are a blue flag car, remain predictable, especially going over the mountain. I'm going to say that again. If you're a blue flag car, be predictable. No kidding, Griffin. Stick to the line and let the faster guys work their way around you. Getting out of the way is often getting in the way. If you're going to surrender a corner right around here or straight, do so smartly. Communicate first with your car and then any other form of communication. If you are lapping another driver, a house. you are an entire lap faster than them. Maybe that's they it. They will need extra space, so give a little room. Uh, pit entry and exit here are both pretty straightforward when it comes to leaving the track and rejoining the track. The pit entry is a little tricky, so you know maybe show a little bit of prudence going into the pit lane. Um, drivers coming out of the pit lane are entitled to race down to turn two, so... Just because they came out of pit lane doesn't mean that they have to give you the, the corner. Please, for the love of God, any God that you worship, no God, the Constitution, George <laughs> Washington, whoever your personal hero is, for the love of that person, heed local yellows, especially early in the race. If you find yourself backwards or sideways or blocking traffic at the start of the race because of a crash, tow. Just tow. It'll be faster for everybody. <clears throat> as the race goes on and things stretch out a little first bit. First on the left, coming out of Forest Elbow. There, but in yeah. the first couple Hold laps, on. if you find yourself blocking the track, please tow. Scraps, no scraps. Uh, we still have a lot of points on offer tonight. Still some battles going on on the point sheet for the money for the money spots. Uh, still time to get into the clean driver, though it looks like it's pretty much locked up in both Must divisions. be that house. You never know. Uh, when it comes to clean driver, we use what's on the sheet. I could get so second too, right? Use what's there. I can't control and points. I can just so control, one, like, after you've you know, the start finish line. Best we can do we is win the race. Actually, so I'm going to do everything I can to win the race, but are locked up already. David Fernandez. You know. But I also don't want to and throw it away. But that's the idea is to win the race. Sure. So congratulations to you two for the clean driver in both divisions. Now go out and have be crazy. But qualifying sixth and, and running a train season. in fourth uh, is still me try, trying to win the race too. So we will be as, posting you know, as we do it, as soon understand that. After the end like of the race. It's, it's, it's a uh, slow build for these races. There. You got to uh, we'll take care of stuff. interviews for the top two finishers in each division. Um, you know who you are. So if I say the number's wrong after the race, figure it out. Um, we don't have 42 cars here, so I'm pretty sure they're going to be looking for 27th place. 
to do the uh, 42th award. So if you finish in 27th, jump yeah, in there Mikey, your, yeah. Um, and then after those are done, I'm gonna jump in there with them. And I will announce the provisional winners now. If we have any protests or anything that determine that there was a penalty that needs to be applied, we will apply the penalty and then officially announce who, who the, the final <laughs> badger lane. Um, Qualifying is important. If you weren't here earlier in the session, the drive through equivalent penalty for this race is going to be 20 seconds time added. So if you get a penalty worthy of a drive through, we will add 20 seconds to your race time. That will be your penalty. E. Does anybody have any questions? You guys got any questions? Nobody at all. All right, this is the last race. Uh, we'll have like a 12 or 13 week break until the next season starts. Get ready for questions to come out. I know I keep saying I'm gonna start posting polls, but it's been really freaking busy. So gonna get some feelers out there for some changes for next season and try to get a schedule together as soon as possible. Uh, we'll probably be asking for some testers to test out a few tracks to see what they think and how raceable it might be. May even throw together a couple fun races just to try it out. Uh, thank you guys so much for coming this season. Uh, every year we get bigger and better, and it's only because you guys show up all the time. Thank you so much, and let's have a good race and a great season. Best league thank administrator you, ever. Thanks, buddy. Thanks, man. Thanks for hosting. Good luck, guys. Yeah, man. Thanks for coming. Really appreciate you, sir. Yeah, good luck, all. Be back. Let me go pee, and then uh, it's AMS time. Ugh. Just so proud of you guys. <laughs> I knew we could get the PPPPPP program to work if we just believe. I forgot to say it though. That and you guys, guys believe it. You guys reached deep. Clap. You guys really reached deep. You made it happen, okay? Now, the bird is the now, word. I am. I'm just so proud of you guys. I, I really am. I mean, I mean, who could have seen it coming? You know? I mean, you guys. You guys started with nothing, okay? And you dug deep. You dug deep, you got out there and put a head on somebody. And now we're living in dreamland. We're living in the PPPPPPPPP program party plan. And we're living the dream, aren't we? It's because of your hard work and dedication that really made it happen. Okay, 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 okay. Okay. <laughs> I got I got qualifying. Oh. Repeat of last week, please. Yes. Yeah, why don't we just end the season on I a two I win streak? I forgot to extend the qualifying, so you will likely only have time for two laps unless you really, really hustle. So hey, if you, you lose hustle. your third lap, you've been warned, and I am sorry. Hey, everyone knows. I'm pulling up my socks. After we said all those nice things about you. Hey, good Sheb. Thanks for the uh, two months, man. I appreciate that. Budman614 with four months. Gator Ray for 20 months. Appreciate it, guys. How's the PPPP going? Uh, well, you guys are absolute legends, and ever since we started the PP program, we have not missed a month yet. So the 12-month uh, PP program keeps getting extended. So it's, yeah, it's nice. Thank you, guys. It's a good Bob. view. Um, yep. Don't forget, guys, this, this stream is sponsored by Asher Racing. Check out the brand new rim. Look, you can see the Mustangs. Go check it out, guys. If you're into uh, super high-end sim racing gear, it's for you.
Go, 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 go. That was a nice shot, wasn't it? <laughs> My PP keeps getting extended? Yes. Clicking. Come on, let me in. Go. Go, go, go. I know, I want to get that third lap in. Don't crash. <laughs> That'd be really bad. Tires, come to me. Try to get a good banker in. Focus? No, Ford Mustang. Hilarious. Don't crash. Oof. He's wheeling it. <laughs> Scarecrow. Get the Asher one, man.
curb. Well, it's a lap. Tires are feeling better. <laughs> Sitting fourth for now. Good. I'll save time on the very final corner. Should. Fuck, fuck, fuck. We're good. Oh. Oh. It up. Uh, wait. I was I went from fifth to fourth and I only beat my time by point zero one. I'll pay back the pedals one month at a time winking face. Thank you, Matt. That even possible. Hey, four sticks, man. Hey, dude. You want them fair and square? Now I'm gonna overdrive it. I went from seventh to fourth and I only beat my time by point zero one. I don't understand. Can't be that close. Still not a zero X. It was that was point two. Oh. I must have. Ah, eh, whatever. I must have looked at it after I crossed the line, and it said point zero one. Oh, it was point two. Wow, it's really close, though. Hey, who's this Rise Gardener? He's third. Oh, damn! Arrow, Arrow, and Jack are on another level. I didn't screw up Chase before. I'd add it. Interested to see if I get this lap in. Oh, yeah, I would have got it. <sighs> okay, well. Okay, I'm happy with that.
Unless, well, it's not over yet. There's the ticket flag. All right, intro time. Welcome to my party. We're just getting started. A life is a dream or a nightmare scarring. Hand me a drink because I think I'm going all in. Get me a shrink. Who can catch me when I'm falling? Cover up my scars. Flip the handlebars. Crash it in my car. Wake up in a bar. I'll be a superstar. Just like my avatar. So bizarre, empty out the reservoir. Yeah, I'm taking six shots, yeah, straight to the face. And I wanna get lost, I'm sick of this place. Don't know how to stop when I'm feeling this way. So I'm taking six shots till I'm feeling okay. I think I'm going crazy. Don't think I'll get on say So I'm taking six shots, all straight to the face. I'm taking six shots, are you coming with me? I'm taking six shots, yeah, straight to the face. And I wanna get lost, I'm sick of this place. Don't know how to stop when I'm feeling this way. So I'm taking six shots till I'm feeling okay. I think I'm going crazy. Don't think a victor will be crowned tonight this is the final race for the american muscle series 2024 season six and we find ourselves at beautiful mount panorama in bathurst australia to finish it out Ooh, it's gonna be wet and wild let's Eight take a look at the points i'm sitting right now in fourth place we did the hard math fabian fabian is not here tonight so tonight will be one of his drop weeks if i get third or better i get third or better in the championship let's make it happen i qualified in fourth some fast guys here this race is going to be sponsored by asher racing check out the brand new wheel they got look at this thing huh check out my latest video about it hey look this is high-end equipment for high-end sim racers like yourself go check it out all right let's get the race going all right I got fuel. Let me check it once more. I did my zen. I'm ready. The estimated strength of field is 2,422. Keep it clean. The DNF today would hurt our points a lot. Place your bets. Thank you, guys. We'll just take it easy. I'm going to run my race. Take it easy. Take care of the tires. See what the fuel situation is. Uh, the championship has not been decided. But they will crown a uh, champion at the end of the race. And we'll definitely include that. Um, if there are any penalties or protests or any any issues with people in the race, some of that will uh, get determined later, but here we go. We'll know. We'll know. Have fun. Yeah, have fun, guys. Same to you, Ed. Oh, this guy's blinking. Same, same. Not good. Oh, it's Southpaw. Southpaw Racer. He's blinking. Green, green, green. Left side. Still there. Hold your line. He stopped blinking, that's good. Still there. Still there. Stay on the right, clear. We'll see how he does.
Missed the gear. Come on, get it together. This is his home track, I would imagine. Southpaw. He freaking just demolished that downhill. <laughs> He's playing spoiler. Jack gets around arrow. There's a lot of draft in these cars, so. See, I think Arrow likes to get pole, and then he doesn't fight too hard in the beginning. Jack passes him, so then he can save fuel and tires, you know? You can bump track, sure. Man, I hope South Southpaw challenges Arrow, throws him off. I'm just chilling at this point. I am just chilling. Could get uh <laughs> this could be interesting. <laughs> no one wants to lead. Sometimes you just wanna hang back just a little bit, and then when you do pounce, you scare the shit out of everybody and they're like, oh dang, here comes Malone! <laughs> and you pass like three cars in once. Nah, it's, it's early, so we're chilling. I'm just seeing what Southpaw's gonna do. Because I haven't raced with him at all. I just don't know what he's gonna do. 
I'm doing my homework. Yeah, that is a big train behind us, huh? Must have been a clean start. Trans Am series? Hell yeah, dude. Jakester! Hey, hey, Malone. Hey, Jakester. How we doing? Thanks for the 33 months, man. Happy Tuesday night. Happy AMS. Happy AMS Championship night. gallon race it's possible especially in my position hey thanks for the sub on YouTube yeah I'm definitely fuel saving chilling seeing what the math looks like Chili nips. Hey, your dog's part of your family. Almost blew that corner. doing a five stream sponsor with Asher Jakester. No, it, it, they Ace Attack and Asher work together too, so no, it's all good.
Yeah, they're really high-end wheel rims for sure. I'm like super impressed by this. Uh, the wheel, I'm gonna be using that rim later tonight. I didn't want to use it, a new rim for the last race of the league. An F1 style rim, so. Arrow hit the wall. That wasn't net code, he slowed down. Ooh, I wonder if Arrow's got damage. <laughs> he's getting a, he's getting pressure from uh, Southpaw here. Ooh, look who's behind me. Black Dog himself. Two gallon race, no tires confirmed. I'm right next to you, Hartman. Come on. Get it. Dreaming of the TA2 series making it into a racing. I work on the number 7 car for Silver Hair Racing and I'm sure a Trans M series following would be strong. Yeah, I've always wanted like a vintage muscle car series, but the Trans Am series would is like legit racing. And I I think that would block guys, block. Satisfy me. Alright, player click. Garrett, thanks for the super chat, man. I appreciate that. Yeah, I agree with you. And that's cool that you worked in that. Worked, uh, worked there. And yeah, we got a petition I racing for it. <laughs> Average giant. Hey, what's up, man? One gun salute. They sell a little like uh, plastic piece that you shove into the hub Sorry, Luke, to I trick fanatics so you can Sorry. use other rims, I guess. I don't know much about it. No worries. SRM sells it. Go to SRM, Sim Racing. Machines? They sell a bunch of cool stuff.
Sim racing mamas. Sim racing mustaches. <laughs> hey, I got one of those. an emulator I think they call it a fanatic emulator it's a little plug you shove into the hub and then you put your wheelbase or your wheel on Jack must have fixed the shifter, true. Do I have a chance to win the championship? I mean, yeah, but... Those two guys leading would have to uh, wreck out like now. <laughs> if I if I get because Fabian's not here this week, if I get podium, I get podium. If I get podium in this race, I get podium in the championship. But yeah, the championship's wide open. Arrow and Jack are fighting for it. Southpaw's playing spoiler, which I love. I love this monkey wrench. If I get fourth with a lap lead, I think I beat Fabian two for third place. moment but the pitting is going to be interesting because I don't want to pit with I don't want anybody in front of me when Thank I'm pitting so you can kind of cut that one corner and save yep. some time In four laps, two, two gallons, no uh, tires. Race is half over. I don't want to undercut. I need a, I need to lead a lap, so I like to stay out as long as possible. I kind of want to get that lap led like I have in the last couple weeks. But I have a feeling everyone's going to make it that extra lap, so. Or not Jack, probably, but. I think Arrow's saved enough. Yeah, Jack and Arrow are battling it out for a championship, basically. I think if they finish 1-2, Jack being first and Arrow second, I think Arrow still takes it.
arrow into the wall there. Into the wall again? Some of this may not be net code. just got a point. Well, he, he already might have uh, led the first lap, but Beaver. Through the dipper, I was sloshy. It was a little wishy washy and sloshy. Hey, Privy, you believe in me? Uh, God, thanks for the prime, dude. Welcome. Real close, man. But once the pit hits, usually helps you on the calculator a little bit.
He glitched out a little there. Still there. Oh, come on. Yeah. Okay, that's my the point. Leader's fitting now. You have about one lap of fuel left. Okay, you are the leader. It's gonna be tight, man. My pit box is way up there, too. This will help. Stay the course. All right. You lifted. You're on the right. Two point one is going to be tight, man. Oh no. Fuel. Might have misjudged this. I'm way over there. I have zero fuel. Pit box team, ten. Take it, take it. I got a bad accent. Ooh, 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 wow. We're in a great spot for some hardware. Go, go, go! The car in C6 just set the master class. 26.4. Oh, no. <laughs> well. I hope, it, I hope it's enough! <laughs> Dude, look at Nick too, man. I could be in fuel problems here, for sure, dude. Oh. Jack had an issue. I may be cutting this too tight. We'll have to see. Once we cross the line, then we'll know for sure after this lap. Because then it'll know after the pit.
lift on up shifts. Yeah, you're probably right. We'll see when we cross the line. We'll know for sure then. save not too much though 0.15 it's four to go no wait 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 I think we're gonna go 17 laps it says 16.05 seven minutes to go no way dude it's three th no it's three laps to go I think I can push no save There's six and a half minutes to go it's two minutes per lap it's three laps fucking arrows right behind me Freaking arrow's not saving. Good lord. He turned on the jets. <sighs> it's two and a half minutes per lap, guys. I don't know. It's going to be close. Yeah, it's 5-12. Whoa, there's Jack. Where'd he come from? They're battling for the championship. 5-0-2 at the line. Oh, no. There's point two, yeah. Look at what the in. hell's going on back there. Thanks, Greg. Yeah, thanks. Miss ship, possibly? It's not gonna be white flag. It's gonna. That's not good. Car right. Still there. Clear 
We're on the rock. One lap of fuel left. Oh god, we're dead. I don't know how to do that very well. We're screwed. I like this. Why? I hate fuel. Rip. We're not. So stupid, dude. After all that. Should just put three in. Left side. Still there. Don't forget to pit for more fuel. Still there. Clear. White flag. Stay smooth. Camp pit. Left side. Clear on the left. This is a real tragedy. Car on your left. Clear, left side. Keep to the right. Clear. Not even close, dude. Right side. Clear. Who's behind me? Three seconds? What a real nightmare. I have no fuel. Clear. 
16.03 laps, guys, and it goes 17 with a pit stop. What a gaggle. Lol. Closing on you. The gap is 1.6 seconds. That's it. We're out of fuel. Car right. Clear. The car behind is closing on you. The gap is 2.3 seconds. Dude. Thanks for pulling me along with you at the end there. So Check annoying. Flag. Check a flag. Uh, job. You did really well. Couldn't even race. Literally didn't even race. Do you guys remember? Mid season, there was a race. Remember, for... if you have the fuel, please gather up the top of the hill for the demo derby pit. Oh, hilarious, Randall. Yeah, if you have the See fuel, if I can hit you again, Randall. join in all of our fun. Yeah, go for it. I had this whole diatribe about the whole saving fuel hey, thing. Hey, Black Dog, what happened in your pit? And I decided I'm never going to save fuel again. And then here well, I am. Uh, everything that could have gone wrong went wrong. Let's just say that. Hey, did anyone else hit a wall that was a ghost wall in their pit phone? I hope one in practice last night at uh, between garage stalls two and three. Yeah, that's, that's pretty much where it happened. Your turkey timeline brought to you by the brand new Asher Racing McLaren Artura GT4 Sport Pro USB Ultimate. It really rolls off the tongue. Yeah, look at this bad boy, huh? Pretty, pretty, pretty nice. Let's get into it. What do we got? <laughs> we know who the biggest turkey is. You're looking at him. What a shame, dude. I can't even race in the championship. My car wouldn't let me race. Oh, no! Boom! That's a hard lick. I did that in practice a couple times. Yeah, dude. Good on uh, Southpaw Racer, man. That was fun. I'm glad I didn't challenge him. Uh, turn two, lap one. <laughs> Chili nips. Yeah, I didn't have enough fuel. I fueled for a 16.03 uh, lap race. And it went 17 laps, so, you know. <sighs> no, it's all my fault. Damn, dude. Huh. <laughs> Shane. Yeah, if I was using the Asher rim, I probably would have won. So yeah, we may, I don't know, what we'll, we'll, we'll take a look at the championship, but the points will be updated here. I don't think there would have been any penalties, right? No one did anything wrong. I want to see if Jack, I mean, if Jack got, I don't even know how they, I don't even know how they finished because that was so far away. Take a look. What a shame. It drove like a really good race, too. Great racing, though, Mom. Oh, let me get caught up. Sorry about that. First of all, uh, Fox Die dropped five gifted earlier on when I was in real uh, try-hard mode. Thank you, buddy. Potsy60 coming in with 73. What a gaggle, exactly. And Huppy Racing dropping five. Thank you, guys. Apparently, no one's watching on YouTube. Hold on. So, yeah. 
should have started swerving. Yeah, slosh the fuel around a little. Oh, now no one's watching on Twitch. Wow, these overlays are working great. Somebody asked me what over overlays I use. Uh, most of what you see is uh, race labs. I use broken overlays. Yeah. All right. Well, let's see. Uh, let's see the. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Wow. Damn, that was a hard lick. Okay. Let's see if the points have been updated. Or maybe we get in... Alright, let's see if the points have been updated. If not. God, dude. Uh, I'm just so frustrated that I missed out on a good an, a good race. I don't even care about the championship. I'm going to be 100% honest with you. Like, I like to do well. But, like, I mean, it would have been nice to get top three, but... I'm most disappointed in the fact that we didn't even get to race the race. <laughs> like, that's why I'm signed up for the damn race. It's to race the race. race. Oh, I just want to race. Can I race the game? Because of stupid fuel. I hate it. If I would have took just a little extra fuel, so what? I would have been right in with Jack and all them and, and back into a train, not even thinking about fuel and freaking battle. Why? Why did... You know what? I'm just going to take the fuel calculator right off the screen. Stupid fuel. Well, to take uh, a little bit of extra fuel, maybe like three seconds, if that. <laughs> like, it's just so annoying. And, you know, I should be smarter than that because I know this track... Is it draft lock track? Like, who cares? I'm gonna if I come out within the train, the lead train, I'm in the race. You know, it's just annoying. All right, it's been updated. The points are in. Are you ready to crown? Your victor. You guys ready? -na 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 -na. Drum roll, please. Aeronom is your AMS champion with 401 points. Jack Sanchez, second place, 392 points. Just, just couldn't do it. Wait, who? Wait, 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 wait. Maybe I should bring up... Okay. This is the actual race we just did. Jack Sanchez won the race. But it wasn't enough. Aeronom got second. This is this race. Southpaw Racer gets third. Kevin, fourth. Phil, fifth. David, sixth. Black Dog, seventh. Nick Beaver, eighth place. Evan, ninth. Matt Malone rounding out your top ten. And this is the championship right here, guys. 401 points for Arrow. Oof. It was close, though. It was close. It was close. I get fourth. Black Dog at top five. He's going to get some money. Kevin Parrish, sixth. There it is. Nick Beaver, eighth. Uh, Randall McGrew, the league administrator? No, 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 no. He can't. He can't. He can't be up there. Oh, man. Matt Malone. 
I had one incident point. I led a lap. Yeah, see, this is... Oh, wait, can you see this? No, you can't. Okay, so these are the points. So Arrow's, Arrow got second place, got 41 points because he got pole position. He led a lap. So he gets extra points for that. Jack Sanchez won the race, but only had a lap led. So they get the same amount of points. What do you guys think about that? Finney McFinger, the league administrator, said if it wasn't for the close points the way we do it, uh, Arrow would be ahead by 100 points. So, <laughs> so say I don't really know how all the math works, but basically it it incentivizes it incentivizes uh, consistency. But man, I, I think there should be a bigger spread in uh, points. You know. Do I run NEC? No. Anywhere. Anyway. There you have it, guys. Another sweaty AMS race. Ugh. Didn't win. If you guys missed any of the AMS races, I have full playlists of them if you want to sit through them all. Watch me make mistake after mistake. Thanks for watching another season of the AMS. Congratulations to Aeronom. But we're, we're nipping at his heels, guys. Make no mistake about it. We're nipping at his heels. <laughs> we're nipping. Hey, who's nipping? I'm nipping. Really kind of manage turn in and throttle control and braking. Oh, man. I'm a little deflated. Omnipotent? It just sucks because... Well, you guys know. Couldn't race the damn race. Couldn't race the race. We stacking PCC? Where's PCC at? Am I ever going to use the new rim? <laughs> Dude, I hope... I hope Finny, like... I don't know. I like the pit stops and everything. I don't know. Hey, Sanchez, dude. I cut it way too close with the fuel. I'm an idiot. I The fuel calculator was telling me it looked like a two-gallon race, so I went with it. But I was just... I didn't really realize how much I was actually saving. Well, no, it went the extra lap. It shouldn't have went the extra lap. We did 17 laps when it said 16.03. No, the fuel calculator is correct. It's just that sometimes I ignore it. <laughs> it was always 17 laps? Yeah, well, no, I... No, it wasn't even that. I, I didn't even realize that till later, but it was... Because I was riding in the train with you guys. And... I just didn't realize exactly how much fuel I was actually saving. And cuz it was ticking way down. It was I had it I had it at 2.1, 2.0 something. So I'm like, "Ah, oh, this is easy." So I'd take my 2 gallons, but I just didn't put it all in consideration about you know, when you're out in the lead, then you're burning all the fuel and it's just stupid, dude. I hate, I hate that fuel situation. I hate it. I hate it! But yeah, no, it was a good season, though. Probably the best season I've had. It, it, hey, listen. The season as a whole... Season 6, 2024 was the most popular, most exciting, best racing season of AMS by far. You're talking grid size. You're talking talent level. 
excitement. I think it was the best season yet, for sure. Just on sheer numbers. Right? Hey, where's your sub badge? Oh, God. Here we go. Uh, ooh, Mo Sports. Let's do it. Another race. Another race. I'll totally redeem myself. How do, how do I feel about the fuel situation? And tell us about Crew Chief, please. I don't use Crew Chief. No, listen. I just uh, got a little overambitious with the fuel. I had been cutting it close the last couple weeks, and it's been working for me, and... The thing about the thing about Bathurst is that when you're saving fuel, when you're riding in a train, you save a lot of fuel. But then when you're all by yourself racing full throttle, you're burning a lot of fuel. So there's a huge, huge difference there, you know? Yeah, there's no pitting in this race. Well, I'm racing the Mustang. <laughs> I could I could change it. <laughs> Anyway, the shame, the real shame. Right back. We'll see what the format is for next season. You know, you never know. Hey, I'm Matt Malone, and I stream iRacing. Thanks for checking out the stream. Looks like we're taking a little bit of a break right now, so just hang tight, you know. But this is a perfect time to type exclamation point socials into the chat. That way, it'll take you to my outdated website, and you can see me all over the internet right there. You got your Instagram, you got your X, you got your YouTube, you got your Twitch. I even started a MySpace account, and also I also have a Threads account, which uh, I never post post on. I've kind of abandoned that, but if you want to follow me on Threads, perfect. You'll never hear from me uh, over there. But this is a good time to just check it out. You know, I'm even on the old TikTok, you know, if you don't worry about some uh, some some nefarious individuals uh, finding out your location and uh, maybe maybe getting to triangulate your, your position and be able to, to missile strike you, you know, you'll be fine over there on TikTok. It's worth a couple laps, you know. So uh, check it out, guys. I'll be back momentarily. Don't worry. So hang out, have fun. Hey, you're part of the community right now. If you're If you're seeing this and you're typing in the chat and you're hanging out, you know, you're part of the community, the sim racing community. One of the best ever, okay? So I'm going to get on out of here because I'm, I'm coming back. I got to get on out of here so I can get on in here. You know what I'm saying? I got I to gotta get out to get in. You know what I'm saying? I don't know what I'm saying. Okay, bye. You talking about Cleo's? Oh, that fucking bitch. Yep. The one that literally caused the whole field to wreck because he wanted to start in the back straight. Oh. Yeah, it was very entertaining to listen to. What is Threads, dude? A I'm, I'm a newbie. Dude, Threads is stupid. I'd never open it. I should just delete my account. No, it was still wrong either way. Because we shouldn't be, like, we shouldn't be on the back straight when it's going green like that. Because then it, it made literally, it was weird, like, six wide going into that turn. Yeah, it was ugly. Yeah, I... I... Especially when we were talking about only two Mustangs, so it's not like there's going to be a wipeout of any sort. Yeah, yeah, yeah exactly. DJ, I mean... Like, I think the talent pool is just rising. I mean, Jack is super fast, man. Good stuff, though. So oh, annoying. Anyway, season over. <laughs> Move on. <laughs> Threads is dumb. I like never post on threads or even look at it, so. Oh, 100% Black Dog. So good, man. And it was so cool to see Southpaw Racer. Matt, you're yes. super fast too. Oh, thanks. Dr. Boral. Boral. Hey, thanks for the uh, resub, man. 
Huge credit goes to Jack's, Jack Sanchez, though, for helping me out with some setups. 100%. Because I was struggling at the beginning of the season. And, uh, yeah, there he is. Sanchez, 420 in the chat. Thanks so much, dude. You had a hell of a season. Thank you for the setups, man. They really did help out a lot. All right, buddy. For real, what happened to my sub badge? Listen, you want a sub badge? You got to pay for it. I don't know. Did you refresh? I don't control the things that happen on Twitch. Let's go M-A-T-T-T. -T -T. Let's get this win. I'm uh, fifth in points for PCC, actually. What do I control? Um, I control... Oh, God, I control what comes out of my mouth and what goes into my mouth. Yeah, I thought you were giving it to me, but happy that you didn't. That was fun. I was trying to do a mixture of both. I don't know, I trusted you, I guess. You picked a good one. <laughs> what would you say you do here? Yeah, I like to try and work on my following skills on the... Stacking PCC? Who's, who's, who from AMS is joining PCC right now, eh? These are SOF races. Well, I think all the, um... You know, my favorite thing about this game was when people behind you pass you, and then when you get behind them, they forget how to drive the line, and they're slow as shit. Or they spin out. It's not a game. Sometimes that happens with me. Like, I'm really good at, like, following someone, you know? And then when I get ahead of them, I'm like, oh, no, what do I do, you know? Bingo. That's for me, for sure. Sometimes no, puts one lap short on fuel too. Okay, okay. It's confusing sometimes too because it's like you you get behind them and you think they're faster than you, and then they don't know how to drive the line. So you just they just break in weird places. It's weird. That's why I just leave the driving line on. It helps. No, you don't. Nah, you're right. <laughs> Congrats on the strong season in AMS, though, man. Yeah, it was a good season. Hey, you're first place in PCC. Yeah, I won PCC and the Thick Series last season, so I'm trying to return as champ. Two time. Hell yeah, give it a go. Get that PDF. It's amazing what we do for a sheet of paper. Not even real. I haven't gotten any paper yet. You know, I didn't get any PDFs last season. Some damage. Let's get that fixed. Guys, if you want to make sure you never run out of fuel again, go ahead, pick yourself up an Asher Racing McLaren Arturu Ultimate Pro USB wheel. What'd you, uh, what'd you, uh, now, I made a video about it. Am I am I getting any better at making YouTube videos? Sincerely, I'm trying, man. I really am. I'm trying new editing techniques that are pretty basic, actually. But my phone records in 4K. So I've been doing that, and what actually really helps is um my room. 
My room is actually like good to film in. It's small. That's the only restriction. Um, but like when you have like a good background and you're not sitting in your kitchen, <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Or whatever. Like it helps with YouTube videos. Um, but I, I've been trying. Samantha's helped me a little bit. But I'm not really like a YouTuber, so I'm, I'm kind of learning it for the first time, but. It's been fun though. Because that video. I actually wrote a script for it, which you can kind of tell. It's a little scripty, you know? Kind of reminds me of those Samsung videos I made, which I didn't really write. A, I wrote some stuff down for it, but. The script definitely helps me a little bit to be like precise, but I wrote a script on Friday, filmed it on Saturday and edited it on Saturday and it was done. So sometimes that stuff has to do with like workflow. Like if you can be efficient with your time and just get it, like get it done and not have to like redo stuff or backtrack and stuff like that. Yeah, DJ, a little bit, yeah. That's right, Jakester. Well, and I was trying to learn about the rim, so I was watching some videos, and I didn't really know much about the McLaren stuff and the Asher stuff, but... It was just a product showcase video, not like a review, but... But, can't spill the beans too early, but some, some more exciting stuff's coming up, so. Run. You gotta be kidding me! Hoosier coming in strong with that raid. What's up, Hoosier? Hoosier Dallas. Thanks so much for the raid, man. Welcome. That's true, checkers. No, when it comes to YouTube videos. Hoosier! Thanks so much for the raid, man. I appreciate that. Tom gifting a sub to Arcane! Yeah, Tom, that was a good season, man. Did you do well in your... Is it the best... Your best season ever? This is one of my better seasons. Oh, yeah. Yeah, what about that foot cam guy? It was like toilet seat cam sim racer. Did he ever read chat at all? I tuned back in as he was getting the white flag, and people were still like, wow, that foot's really going good there. <laughs> Sorry, guys. Uh, a lot of my raids aren't usually the best. It's Sometimes when you're searching for a diamond in the rough... You just find rough. He farted and left. Unbelievable. I mean, I just don't get the mentality of like, oh, I'll stream, but I'll also make sure I have no way of knowing who's watching and no way of reading chat. Like, why are you streaming? I don't get it. Makes no sense to me. If you just want to document it for your own purposes and then just record yourself, don't stream into the world. And then wonder why no one watches you. Or, you know, you know, or, you know, whatever. You know, it's just weird. Like even after the race, he didn't say anything. <sighs> I don't get it. Oh, there you go, Tom. That's improvement. If you can chart that shit out using all the data and you show improvement, it's, what, what else? What else are we doing here? You know, it's good. It, it was a double dare. <laughs> Somebody's like POV. We're literally his toilet. This is the view of his toilet. <laughs> Oh, 
I got a question. Where is uh, Falcon Tire this week? Because we'll race the McLaren GT4 if you guys want in either the fixed. We can do the fixed GT4. I think that's what it'll be after this would be the fixed one. I don't think it's the Falcon. Imola. All right. Well, we can do that. McLaren GT4 using the McLaren GT4 rim, guys. Get ready. It's gonna be amazing. I'd love to see a video on someone doing like a, what's the new GSI one? Like the P1 HyperX Epic rim. Do a comparison between that and this new Asher one. Maybe Quirk can come down and try out the Asher rim. Because he's tried the new Hyper PX. The Hyper P90X. Hosted race with the McLaren F1, GT3, and GT4. When my loins start to tighten, Malone be the one driven. It's been forever since I've caught a stream. Good luck. Thank you, Rowdy. We getting rowdy tonight? Thanks for the niner, buddy. Good to see you. Hello, we have been trying to reach you about your car's extended warranty. <laughs> Dan McCarr, thanks for the five, everybody. Black Flag E Motorsports, thanks for the sub over on YouTube. Wiley Wolf, thanks for the three months. Didn't see that one, I don't think. You guys are, uh, oh, nice. The advertisement's covering up. It's over here. If you guys are watching on YouTube, don't forget to uh, download the video and share it to your grandmother's iPad. No. Oh, just hit the like button. That'd be way easier. I don't know. L7, what's up, man? I have a question. Shoot! Is the Moza R16 and the CRP pedals, it's good? I don't know about the pedals. But a Moza R16 is a is a is a good base, I'm sure. 16 newton meters. It's a good it's a good healthy strength for sure. 100 percent actually. Um people like the quick release for the Moza. I mine wasn't that great when I tried it. It has like those ball bearing things. I didn't particularly like it, but uh, some people think it's fine. Hey, Bill, I got 10th. I ran out of fuel. I ran out of fuel. I like to record my PC monitor with my phone watching your YouTube videos and then share that. That's good, Drift Nick. That's a smart thing. I'm too tired to come up with something witty, so just pretend this message is hilarious. Okay, thanks. But <laughs> every time you you crack me up. Swine meeper, thanks for the seven, buddy. The Moza QR is hard. Oof. Nice and hard. Alright. Oh, fuel up, buddy? Okay, okay. Okay, okay. Okay, okay, okay.
One to go. Next time by. Line up on the right side. Your parents are Here's 70, X Wolf? My parents are 70. Pit road is closed right now. But Keep I, it clean. The DNF today would hurt our in your, a lot. What you, you said you were 10 years older than me? Hey, Luca, what's up, man? No, I was going to ask Luca the last time he was in my stream why he changed his name. But I didn't ask him. I waited until he was live, and then I went into his stream and asked him. Because it's much easier just to say it than it is to try to type it out. Have a good race, guys. But it makes sense. <laughs> Is this Road America? Oh my no, gosh, it's uh, Road Canada. Deal. Most sports. Well, Luca's name oh, was GSI day. Luca. But he wanted to make it a little bit more personal just to him. And not always attach his name to GSI. Well, not that they the fired him the yet or anything, but... I mean, there's been some rumblings in the office about Luca's not... Carrying his fair share around here. Oh, Luca's not handling customers very well. Oh, Luca didn't give away all those rims he promised. Oh, Luca, you know, and he's had a couple of written warnings. Um, I know at the last company picnic, Gomez, uh, you know, he wasn't really sharing his potato salad too much with Luca, you know, so. No, there's a slow, you know, stepping back from a GSI position, you know, and he wants to make the stream just his, you know. <laughs> Listen, Luca changed his name to make it more personal, so when he blows up, He can take all the revenue and not have to give some of it to GSI. <laughs> yeah, he, I heard he sabotaged the Secret Santa this year. He told Debbie in HR that he got cruise tickets. And she got mad because she realized, oh, the presents aren't, like, equal for everyone. And that was a... made a big uproar in the office, you know. And, uh, people started getting jealous, you know. Oh, Luke is going on a cruise and all I got was this, you know, muffin tin, you know. <laughs> I talked to my new boss for the first time. It seemed cool. Good. Will Dan Suzuki be changing his name to GSI Suzuki? <laughs> Debbie does our secret Santa. What a gem. Matt, what place is in the championship? For PCC, I'm fifth right now. With only five weeks out of six counted, so. I didn't really start doing these packed PC. What uh what week is it in iRacing? Let me guess, it's week six. For AMS, I ended up fourth. Is it week six in iRacing right now? Okay. So, yeah, I've only missed one week, PCC. Wait. Get ready. No, this Go is week train. six. So, no, no, I'm up to date. Yeah, once I do this race, I'm good. No kidding, mainframe. That's epic, dude. Nice That's going to be ready. fun, man. Gonna be a hell of a weekend for you, buddy. Flag, Here we green go, flag. green flag and a racing. Car on your left. Still there. Clear on the left. <laughs> Whoa, dude. Who's that blue and white car? Strength of field of 3.4. What's the SOF just for Mustangs, though, I wonder? Oh, it's pretty high. Look at our car numbers. Pretty good. Oh, I 
think there's a video footage of mainframe from the Ace Tech store. Oh yeah, there he is. He's caught on CCTV. Let's see if we can get another camera view. Oh yeah, there he is. Oh, oh you're checking out mainframe. Yeah, did you find everything okay? Ooh, big weekend. Uh, you got a big weekend coming up, putting all this together, don't you? Oh yeah, oh yeah. Well, that's gonna be fun. Oh, God. Okay, I'm losing it. Okay, on the left. <laughs> Clear on the right. Whoops. Right side. <laughs> Each to the left. Oh no. It's boxing Clear me out, bro. Right. Alright, Malone, your gimmicks are slowing you down. <laughs> We'll catch him, it's fine. You ever heard of a little thing called traffic? Traffic on the nines. Clear sailing. Actually, it'll be a while before we hit traffic. You wanna to speak to the manager? I am the manager. Whoa, buddy. You're gonna take your business elsewhere. Okay. Sorry. Not sure how I avoided that mess. Samantha's a single mother of three. <laughs> True. Is this hold my beer inner Lagos? No, this is most sports. Tokyo, good to see you, man. Can I put a message in the Gaggle Discord to push the setup stream? I don't know what that means, but go ahead. Oh, for Ace Attack? Sure, man. Chat and race, not very well. <laughs> it's on my screen, so. Alright, we gotta catch the leaders here. Of the Mustang on Tuesdays, don't I? Not anymore. Yeah, we'll have to find out what we want to do Tuesday nights, you know? Just a normal stream, I guess.
Super flat for you. Is Mooncar on Tuesdays? Please tell me yes. I thought it was Mondays. No shit, Pandora. What time on a Tuesday? I'll totally do it. I've been waiting to do that. Right now? Perfect. Um, so how does that work? Do I have to get invited or should I message him or is it like first come first serve or Let's we'll totally do that next week. I'm gonna pass this guy. Oh, the lights? Oh, there's like a pre thing. Wow. You to let me in. Maybe I'll show them my two Daytona 500 winning trophies and they'll let me in. Maybe I'll message him. I'm, I'm on the Discord. One more until the big hundo. The uh, Mooncar Discord. Fraxis, 99 months. This guy's a legend. What's up, buddy? Trevor Merrick, thanks for the 26 months, buddy. Trevor Merrick gifting subs. Unbelievable. Thank you, man. I'll push him. Though he thinks I'm his friend. <laughs> and later. I'll rescind my friendship. Oh. I guess we're not... I guess we, we don't have to battle for the lead. Those leaders are way too fast anyway. Go ahead and pass right, Mac. When is traffic going to be an issue? Mm, it won't be too much of an issue. The car in P2, just left the path for class, 29.11.
I like this game. I think I'll continue to play it. catching the leaders. Maybe I'll just stay behind them and help them. I got it. round rims for these cars. I'll, I'll push him. It is a Clio! Too much damn fuel in the tank. At least we don't have to pit in this race. Going wide. The last time I raced PCC, I just plowed right into a Clio. <laughs> he had it coming to him. He deserved it. Look, if you're driving a Clio to go get groceries, you are definitely using self-checkout, and you're definitely not scanning certain items. <laughs> uh, I don't know. It didn't be, but I, uh, I don't work here. I don't know how it works. Sure that Walmart was gonna start charging people to use the self checkout. Whenever I use self checkout, I just feel like I'm getting ripped off. Cody, I'm gonna It's just not right, right man. You pick your spot. Yeti Dynamics, what's up, dude? Yeah, when's the employee party? That's what I always say. Do I prefer to wait in line? Um. I would rather they just have normal checkouts open. Self-checkout really doesn't bother me if I have like a handful of things. But I don't like it when I got produce or like some obscure item where like, I don't know. I don't know how to scan this in, you know? But if I just got a couple things and I, I know exactly how to locate the barcode on the items, then I'm like, yeah, it's self-checkout's fine. 
But I like how there's somebody just standing there. And I'm the only one... And I'm the only one doing the self-checkout. And I'm like, why don't you just do it for me? Like, you're just standing there doing nothing and watching me work. Like, that, it just, there's something about it. It just rubs me the wrong way. I'm just like, and then they're like, thank you. And I'm, they're like, have a good day. I'm like, yeah, well, okay. Oh, shit. I don't know, it just makes me very spiteful when there's somebody just standing there and I'm having to do the work. But, ah, whatever, I get it. Seventeen fifty an hour? Not so bad. It's your it's the first job for you. Colin, you left. Still there, hold your line. Still there. Still there. <gasps> Go left. <gasps> Baby, fast and furious, let's go! Don't make it three wide. Oh, the push! Thank you. <laughs> that was a block. <laughs> oh, now he's coming for it. I won't block him this time. Oh. Oh, they're both going wide. They're going wide off the track. Oh, shit. Oh, fuck. I broke something. Something's dragging. Oh. Oh, There's a slight vibration. What the hell's going? And they lived. <sighs> I broke my wheel on that curb. I. <laughs> Oh, did I? I think I broke that guy. Yeah, that was good stuff. <laughs> Twenty-year-old car, too much rust. Oh my! Oh my gosh! I can't turn. Oh, I didn't hurt anybody else. That's good. Wait a minute. These guys went wide and they saved it. How? Wait a minute. I was, I was just like, I was laughing at them. And I was like, I was just watching them. Oh, it's because of the new grass physics that they didn't die. See, back in the day, I'm used to touching one blade of grass and just speeding up into infinite miles per hour and just right into the wall. <laughs> that was a great save. <laughs> I was just... I was just like, oh, I got I got one over on these guys. I thought I was like winning. I was like, ah, I got these guys. They all went wide. They're all in the fence. But nope. Oh, in the past, this was sure death. Oh, 100. Yeah, oh, yeah. You're you're just as soon as you touch the grass, you, your car stops rotating. And you just go straight into the wall. That was amazing. Oh, Malone. I'm all hurting. Hurting for a squirting. <laughs> I'm going to see it from uh, this guy's view. Hold on. Cockpit. Oh! <laughs> Look at my car. Oh, no. It's like watching a three-legged dog. You feel bad, but... Don't have the heart to put him down. Fixed the grass, broke the wheels. Oh man. Typical Ford. 
Okay. Oh, it is Falcon Tire. Oh, we got 22 minutes. All right, perfect. Okay, McLaren. Do the McLaren. There it is. Ah, it's just like the one in the... Uh... Let's see. I tried to find one that was close to it. See, this, I couldn't find the right paint job, but this, compared to this, is pretty close. Blue and the orange. Right. All right, here we go, guys. This is it. It's what you've been waiting for. Putting on... The Asher Racing McLaren Artura GT4 Pro Sport Ultimate Wheel Rim. Going on. Easy peasy, just like this. Let's get, uh... Let's see. Thought I had the other camera. There it is, in all its glory. This isn't really the best view, is it? Not really. Can I move this around? Oh, hello. A little better. Toilet cam. Base attack base is wireless compatible. Jakester, check this out, dude. There is a little USB-C cord that connects to the inside of the Ace Attack quick release to the back of the, the Asher Racing uh, we, uh, rim. And you get like a four or five inch USB cord and it connects it. USB-C to USB-C. They give you one if you select this. Dude, it, it's, it's amazing. So... You don't have this situation. This tangled of a mess. You see? That's the difference. Which is pretty cool. Now, I, I do know GSI was working on that, but I haven't heard anything about it. Same thing with my uh, oval rim. Got that big-ass cord. So this one's just like, it's just right on there. All right, let's practice. Yeah, it's basically wireless, yeah. Yeah, it's super cool. So, this particular rim is not wireless. Asher does make rims that are wireless, but I believe this one's not. And I, and I misspoke, or I didn't misspeak. I was uninformed when I made that YouTube video. But I believe, I believe this one's not wireless. If you go down here a little ways. Uh, where was it? It's got everything, dude. I'm sure, where did I see that? Here it is. Okay. 
So uh, this is the symbols I was talking about. See these little symbols right here? This is wireless USB, wireless USB, USB, USB. Because this is the USB one. So will they come out with one that has a screen that's wireless? I mean, I don't know. If, I don't know. But these two are wireless. But this one it looks like it has less functionality than this one. And this one's not wireless. So I don't know. Maybe they will, but. And it's pretty cool, though. Pretty, pretty cool. Okay, let's find a. Uh... Get this set up quick. Get in the car and then uh, I'm gonna add that camera. Import fees? Hold on. He said something about that in my email. Un momento. Uh, so the ultimate is priced at fourteen ninety nine euro, including. And then in parentheses, including 19% VAT. Is that what you're talking about? I don't, I don't, I'm an American, I don't deal with that. But does that mean the $14.99 includes the VAT or you have to pay an additional 19%? <laughs> Bowling for soup, you betcha, buddy. Uh, so if for, 1,500 euro is like, I don't know, maybe 1700 US? Let's find out. Instead of practicing. Uh, 1500. 1600. So 1600 US. So another 100 bucks. Okay, uh, let me add this camera. That's definitely big enough. Just for five streams, guys. Don't worry. <laughs> All right, let's try it out. <laughs> I literally haven't even raced with it, really. So, but the uh, the steering wheel on the screen for this car is isn't the same one, so I don't understand. Turn it off. It's only the Art Artura McLaren. Does it come with a huge box? <laughs> Does it come in a huge box? Because that's where I'd have to live after my wife throws me out for spending that kind of dough. So what I actually love about the uh, the buttons. There's a pit. pit um, all the button caps. They're like... They're like perfect buttons because the light shines through. There, there's cool labels and everything. Fuck, dude. I'm just trying to get... Still there. Clear. Let me reset. Hold on. Um, Damn, dude. This thing's lighting up. Now I'm just running on default. So Asher gives you a pre-made sim hub profile it's pretty easy to install i don't know anything about sim hub 
when I got my GSI, I had the guys from GSI uh, get SimHub up and running for me through TeamSpeak. Yeah, believe it or not. <laughs> I just didn't get it. <laughs> I didn't have time to mess around with it. But I was able to do this all by myself in really, like, record time. Yeah, this feels good. I need more force feedback. I was when I was making the video. I set it up at a spa. I was just trying to get around the track a little bit. Yeah, Team Viewer, ever heard of it? Where somebody can uh, control your computer. <laughs> That's what boomers do. Clear. Yeah, nematodes, right? Okay, so I don't really drive this McLaren too much, but keep to the left. Clear on the right. And these these grips are different than the GSI ones. These are like softer, more grippier. This thing's nice, man. <laughs> Does the government control your computer? No. Bill Gates does. Duh. Man, I should probably turn down the L RGB uh, shift lights, though. They're super bright. Is there plenty of room in the thumb hole? Hey, bend over and I'll tell you. Yeah. Slow car on the left. You got a slow car on the left. Uh and it's kinda hard to tell, huh, from that angle. Yeah, I used it with gloves and your thumb fits in there. I, I okay, I see what you're saying, like So I can't just like pivot my thumb up, it'll hit it. You know what I'm saying? Like if you're gripping it tight and you lift your thumb all the way up, it hit it hits it. So if that's what you're asking. But it's tough, dude, with wheels because you want everything within reach. You know, there's like a trade-off, you know? You need all the buttons within reach, but you also need room to maneuver. But I don't feel restricted at all. If I want to lift up my thumb, I, I, I can. When you crash, you're gonna break your thumb. Ah, I don't. I mean, I guess it depends on your hands, but I'm never really scared about that. You got the double shifters too. Like uh, you can shift up and down with one hand if you want. I think I'm doing pretty good. I could see people with very large hands maybe having an issue. To me, it's super comfortable. I have just normal hands, I think. Yeah, super expensive steering wheel, and I put a Logitech C920 camera on it. Smooth, Malone. I've come to like Imola a little bit more over the years. I used to dread coming here, but... Oh, Suzuki's got cameras worth more than uh, my whole setup. <laughs> you broke your thumb because the hole was tight? The rim whipped around and I couldn't get it out in time. C920 
seems like seems like you need to work on your reaction times. Oof, oof. Close one. Yeah. That's not good. The wheel isn't for someone like Kareem Abdul Jabbar. I think it's fine for 99% of hands. Simicube hands off detection. Good job, buddy. I mean, I love the look of the wheel. It just, it's so balanced. Like, to be honest, the other Asher rims, like, they just feel like they're missing something. Like, in the middle, like, they shove all the push buttons to the edges. And then they, like, put in those big cranks at, like, the bottom center. The rotary dials. And then there's just, like, nothing. It's like, eh, it's kind of missing something. But this one with the screen and everything and the, and the rotary knobs where they are, it's so balanced aesthetically. Not that it matters. The look of the rim really doesn't matter that much. But it is probably the coolest rim I've ever seen in real life. You don't like GT3? No, I do. I, I really like the Falcon tire series, and this rim is for a McLaren GT4. Not necessarily this one, but this is as close as I can get in iRacing to be driving basically this Asher rim McLaren Artura GT4. Because the, uh, Asher makes the real race steering wheel for uh, the McLaren GT4. Yeah, Chili Nips. No, I totally get it. Like, like it's just a well-designed wheel. Like, it's well thought out for layout. I got a thumb encoder. Oh, man, I should show you this. So the grip... What can you guys actually see? Oh, okay. So you see my thumb right here? On the C920 camera? The shitty camera? <laughs> so the grip is, like, at, cut at an angle right there. It's actually super comfortable like the to rest way. your... I bet you people would race like this. If you're afraid of uh, putting your thumbs like this, you would rest them here because this is like at an angle right here, and it's very comfortable right here. Plus, th this is a thumb. This is a thumb. Um, this is a uh, a thumb encoder. This is a thumb encoder right here. You probably can't even see it. It's like hidden. I didn't even realize it was there for a while. Mic check. Focus. You're good, bro. I'm practicing. And then you have all these buttons with within the, reach, like boom, 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 boom. Note. Like note. pushing, like look at that, it comes up. And there's another thumb encoder right here. Two funky switches, perfectly within reach. Right, left. I don't really see myself using the rotary dials at all. But there is a way you can set it up to where I'm pretty sure I'm understanding this correctly. If you set you can set it up to where you set the rotary dial to a certain position and then it'll basically change the functionality of the rest of the buttons. So like now I'm in like mode two and that like changes the functionality of and so all the buttons can do different things at that point. You know what I'm saying? You can have like so many different buttons on here. <laughs> it's crazy. But <laughs> Yeah, Jakester. <laughs> So, for instance, like, let's say you set it up to where, I don't know, red 2. If you set it to red 2, now these two buttons are your traction control, up and down. Then you set it to red, your 
red one and then these are back to break bias or I mean there's a you know whatever makes sense for you because right now I got these set up to break bias I just went with the default button caps I didn't change any button caps or anything but there's so many button caps it comes with with a bunch of different labels and stuff And I think something with the RGB shift lights and or the button caps where it's like a single node so you get like zero bleed. I'm using words that I don't know right now. But like sometimes you see like when things are LED backlit, it'll bleed into the next light. But apparently this doesn't do that because everything's like its own container. That makes sense. Who needs that many buttons? Oh, I don't. <laughs> Holy kebab, yeah. Stuff I heard and I'm reg regurgitating. And then hopefully we'll see it, but I'm pretty sure like all the lights will react to the eye racing flags, you know, how wheels do that. Side RGB ones do that. And then I added it, I added it in the video. Race, I think it, I forget the YouTube channel, Race Beyond Matter or something. He's got a really good YouTube channel. But when he was at the Sim Racing Expo, the guy was talking about how they implemented and programmed the profiles to like 10 or 20 different iRacing cars where it's the perfect shift point the RGBs will show you. Three hundred millimeters diameter. Sixty nine registered. I didn't realize you were such a purveyor of such fine treasures. Gotta get that booty. Yeah, Asher reached out and I was like, uh, I'm kind of working with Ace Attack right now. They're like. Oh, Ace Attack? Yeah, we work with them, too. And then Ace Attack's like, Asher? Oh, yeah. Yeah, do it. Oh, okay. okay. <laughs> you want to you wanna do what? You got a new wheel? Oh, I'll check it out. Fucking badass, to be honest. It's actually really nice. I mean, it's overkill, obviously. But... Does all that info travel through a single USB? Yeah. Yeah, it's just... USB-C. USB-C, what I did there? Be right back. We got a good race. We got a Falcon tire race, guys. You got your Falcon tires on? Well, it looks like we're taking a little bit of a break right now from the stream. A little bit of AFK time. A little bit of me time. A little bit of away from chat time. You know what I'm saying? A little zen time, okay? But I'm sure it won't be very long. It looks like, looks like... Yeah, I'm, I'm just getting word in right now that we are taking a little bit of a break right now from the stream. I'm sure I'm sure things will resume shortly. Uh, just sit back and relax. A good time to cool the keyboard off just a little bit. You know, you guys have been going at it pretty hard there. So, you know, maybe it's a good time for you to go get maybe a little snack, a little, a little chocolate milk uh, for you there. You know, yeah, have, a little, have a little nice beverage there for you when I come back. Uh, so uh, we're just taking a little bit of a small little break right now. So I'm sure it won't take too long. Uh, these things uh, take only mere minutes, okay? Uh, but we'll be back uh, shortly here. The uh, stream will uh, continue on uh, after this little bit of a break that we're taking uh, right now. So don't, don't worry. Don't worry. Uh, don't worry about it too much. It's nothing to get hung up on. Uh, it's just a little bit of a break from the stream right now. And I'm sure we'll be uh, getting things started back up here real shortly. So I'm sure there's a race coming up or some sort of situation where we'll be driving a, a fake car on a fake racetrack, uh, talking to chat. It, it's gonna, it's gonna be fine, guys. Don't worry. It's just gonna be a little bit longer before the the things start uh, heat back up again. So just, just relax, okay? Just, just relax. And uh, these, these things usually don't take very long. So just, just relax and sit back. And, and, and relax, 
and that way we can get things going back again, okay? So, so just wait, just hold. Taking a little bit of a break, guys. Oh yeah, so if you touch the screen, it shows you the standings. See that? You know, let's go to a bigger camera. Uh... So if you just touch it, it'll change it to, uh, these are the standings. Um, we're in practice. That's cool. Brandon just hit a 150. Does the screen go down real far? What does that mean? Uh, do you feel like you're missing anything on an ultra wide over triples? Yeah, I'm missing the width of one 32-inch monitor. I am missing half the width of a 32-inch monitor on each side. You know what I'm saying? Because this ultra-wide is like having two 32-inch monitors put together. So yeah, you're missing some FOV, but I think it's a great trade-off for the seamlessness and... I just like ult ult I like the ultra wide over triples, no bezel. You miss FOV, but <laughs> why did my brain do that? Well, my I have brain damage, so. <laughs> well, that's what it is. You don't notice the be bezel? Yeah. I like it because it's, you get better frames, a little bit better frames, and it's less cords, and it's just simpler. You don't have to deal with, like, NVIDIA surround. You can run triples without using NVIDIA surround. Yeah, I know, but it's just getting the angles just right, and, I, you know, I, I used to have triples. Not great triples, but maybe someday I'll go back to triples. I don't know, but I, I really like the ultra wide. Yeah, I stood, I stood there outside on April 8th and watched the solar eclipse with my bare eyes for like a good seven minutes. I never really had issues with NVIDIA surround, to be honest, back in the day, but... I mean, it would always glitch out sometimes, but... <laughs> it wasn't too, too bad. Samsung, sell me the Odyssey windshield. Green, green, green. No. Okay, here comes your first time lap. I wonder if I'm the only McLaren. Think I'm the only one using this rim? <laughs> Probably. You think I'll still get last place? Guaranteed. <laughs> I know. 
Hey, how'd the league race go? I got 10th. I ran out of fuel. It's kind of, it's, it's kind of a touchy subject right now for me. No. I got fourth overall in the championship. Sunil, oh, I pray. Uh, sorry. Hey, thanks for the raid. Welcome, welcome, everybody. We're just about to start a race. Sorry for the overlay overkill. Doing a little sponsorship with Asher Racing. Checking out the new rim. Hola, Buenos Dias, Mikasa Sukasa. Oh, almost had it. Ah, dang it. Hey, muy bien. Muchos gracias. E2, E2. We got a lot of Spanish uh, books in the house. My wife is a... Uh, she used to be a bilingual teacher. So she's She knows Spanish. She's got all these books. And the kids will bring me a book, and it's all in Spanish. I'm like, I can't read it. And Samantha's like... Just describe the pictures. Like, oh, uh, have to be creative. <laughs> Necesito por favor, mia, mi. Oh, wait, wait. What's what do I usually say? Necesito por favor, el jefe. Y tú, dónde estás, McLaren? Hey, what's that blue light? Why is it blinding me? What's that red light? Low fuel? This thing's got all sorts of features. I think that's this pit now. Oh, for fuel. Oh, yeah, I don't have any fuel. Oh, that's cool. There's the flag. It's over. Oh, nice, sober to drunk. Dude, this it's a nice rim, man. I mean, it's, it's top of the line rim. I don't know what to tell you. I mean, this isn't for, like, people starting out, I guess. <laughs> yeah, it's way too overkill, man. It's incredible. It is comfortable. Yeah, this one came with a little shaft on it. This is how they sent it. It's got that kind of the medium extended shaft, which I think you need because look at these paddles. Look how far the, okay, if I can freaking orientate myself. Look at these paddles, how far they stick out. So I think they have to go with that. The, this is the extension for the Ace Attack. And when you buy an Ace Attack quick release, it comes with like three, at least three uh, different size uh, extensions on it. So that's kind of nice. Probably not push on that screen if I uh, put it on there like that. Those are the wheels' ears. So I, I set this up as a uh, gas because I didn't know. It, these are supposed to be your clutch. See the clutch bite point at 50, and then the other one's at 100. I know I have it set to the gas, but <laughs> you get the idea. You've upset the officials with your slow driving. Your lap times won't count until you reset the car and start over. Yeah, it's like all machined out of like one piece. Dude, it's, yeah, it's incredible. It really is. All right, we're starting last, basically. Good to see you. Something a little special today. We're taking a look at the brand new Asher Racing McLaren Artura 
GT4 Sport Pro Ultimate. Here it is in all its glory. Wow, look at that super high definition webcam I have. I'll show you. <laughs> there it is. Now available if you want to. We're just trying it out, you know. We're trying it out. We got it hooked up to the Ace Attack Invicta. And we're getting after it. We're doing the Falcon Tire Sports Car Championship. And hey, we're in a McLaren GT4. Perfect. Let's grid. One lap to green. Line up on the right side. The estimated SOF is 2027. Pit road is closed. Got so much stuff on the screen. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Good enough for now. <laughs> it's only five streams, guys. Don't worry. <laughs> Catch up, 25 car. Yeah, the Asher Racing Wheel. The screen has ray tracing. That's right. <laughs> you can hardly see the track. Yeah. So it makes it fun. Alright, guys. You know Falcon Tire. 30 minutes, multi class, LMP3s, GT4s. Let's see what we can do, man. This will be fun. Testing out the new wheel. First real race with it. Got so many features, I don't even know what half of them they are. Here we go. Green, green, green. Green, green, green. Car on your left. Still there, hold your line. Stay on the right. On the right. Oh, they're wrecking. Go left. Oh, he saved it. Left. Sort of. I yielded. Oh go my right. god, dude. Why are you moving the, the brake? Right. No moving under braking, guys. Still there. Clear on the right. Go, go, go. Check the standings. Okay, good. Got it right on my wheel, guys. Don't worry. Go right. I'll be nice. He slowed down. You know, I haven't really driven the McLaren GT4 in a while. Pretty nice. I'm not trying to sell you the wheel. I'm just telling you about it. It's available. It just came out. It's like brand new. Just trying it out. Definitely one of the most comfortable rims I've ever used. The grip on it is real nice. I don't wear gloves, so... But it is brand new, so maybe once I start sweating on it, maybe the grips will change, you know, get greasy, but we'll see. Keep to the left. Clear on the rock. Woo, got it. Nice. That's an overtake. Sorry about that, bro. I looked it over at the race. I, I was making sure I did. The wheel retails for 1,500 euros. I think it's like 1,600 US. Yeah, it's a top of the line situation. Ashante left and we got hooked there, Michael. My apologies. Oh. 
mean, it's, it's hard to find flaws in a rim at this price point, you know? <laughs> The land of off tracks. No, I use race labs. No, thought I might have cut that too much. How do I take care of this? next corner I feel like he's okay I don't know I suck at slowdowns I feel like if I give it away on the straightaway, I lose. I always lose way more. Long race, it's all good. I feel like I got decent pace. Sounded like I was really bogging down, so I downshifted. Still there. Still there. Hold your line. Hang it. That lost me way more time than the slowdown. Where's the rim made? I don't know. Thanks, Rudy. The car in P1 just set the path of lap. 51.3, 41, right side, go on the left. Second gear on that last corner? Yeah. We can get him, guys. We get a top five. And we are the number five car. We kind of expected to do that. So it is replicating the iRacing flags. I'm using the uh, Asher provided Sim Hub profile that comes with it. And if you'll notice, or no, that why would it have gone blue back there? I don't know. We'll just have to see. We'll see when the blue cars come up. Still there. Clear. See, it's blue again. 
Why is that? The RGB lights are very, very bright. I need to turn them down. It's blinding me. <laughs> Davey DeGroot. Thanks for hanging out, buddy. Later, nerd. <laughs> Dude, this McLaren's driving amazing. Yeah, I'm sorry, man. Man. Why did you block like that, dude? You know you have to take the outside on that, on that turn. There was no fucking reason for you to block the inside on that turn, dude. My go-to GT4 car is usually Mercedes, but this thing feels way more nimble than Mer the Merc. Brock, it's been going good. Okay. Fifth place is ahead of us. Sort of. I don't know about that neck arm, but it does feel good. We can do it. I have a windshield wiper button? I don't think this car has a windshield wiper. Got that chunk of rubber right there in the middle. It's a fun combo. I'm glad I did this. I might do the next one. <laughs> Here they come. Okay, now I'm showing the blue on the sides. Yeah, you can see that in the camera. That's what the flags are. I don't know what that other blue, big blue bar was. Okay, I get it now. So the way the wheel mimics the iRacing flags is the six LED lights, three on each side of the screen. It's pretty common in other wheels as well. That's all customizable. All right, we caught up to these guys. All right, goal is top five for sure. Aston and uh what a Merc? Yep. Good to see variety in GT4. Doing stuff that I see Ashton's do a lot. <laughs> Getting loose. Hi, Matt. The blue bar is traction control kicking in. There's just solid blue f that one time, like for no reason. I was in a straight line. I don't know. Faster traffic approaching.
GW Bar, thanks for the 39, man. I appreciate that. Welcome, welcome. Perfect, perfect, perfect. Go for it. Oh, I went in deep. Oh, I kind of threw off the Aston there. Wasn't super gentlemanly of me, but got it done. Come on, dude. Why do you move the other way after you've moved in the corner? Left side, clear on the left, two wide. You're in the middle, three wide. Clear on the left, two wide. I win. Clear on the right. <laughs> Go on your left. Clear. Sorry. Beef. Like, oh. You understand that you just like can't move over to block people after you fuck up, right? I think I might have seen that though on no soldier on the sides though. I saw it yellow too. Clear, Clear on the left. Oh. I'm using I'm using traffic to my advantage. It's working out great by the way. <laughs> Okay, okay, I'll, I'll hit the brakes full on here and see if it goes yellow. Yeah. Too much ABS! Yeah, it went yellow. Confirmed. Go, 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 go. Left side. Clear on the left. On your left. Stay on the right. Faster traffic approaching. Clear. Oh, the shifters are very good. They're not super clicky. They're very muted, but a good tactile feel. Yeah, they're like... When you shift, it sounds expensive. Because <laughs> they have double, uh, double uh, rubber bump stops on each end. Yeah, I love the shift. I that was that's always been one of my biggest pet peeves is super clicky shifters. Like, where it's just like plastic on plastic, cheap garbage toy stuff. I always hated that. The higher end wheels don't seem to do that. The car in C1 just set the faster flat. 50.683. Wow, well, true McNugget. You go for it. Faster traffic approaching. Car on your left. Clear. Yeah, I love the way they feel and sound for sure. You got a slow car on the right. Maybe I can catch this guy. Pa 
Paul Nye Sr. Uh, probably not chili nips. Comparing it to what? I did on my latest video, I clearly uh, do the paddle shifters. But I just do it after the race. I mean, I guess it wouldn't be that hard of a video. I could do the Ace Attack one, this one, GSI. I even have an MPI ram with a turn. I'd probably leave that one out, though. I know the Forte F1 style rim, it's nice and muted as well, the shifters. Yeah, so it's, it is cool because I, I got this, you can get the, um, through Asher get the Ace Attack quick release. And uh, they give you a mini, a really short, small USB-C to USB-C cord. And in the direct center of the rim in the back, it's a female USB-C, and then inside the quick release, there's a female USB-C, and so it just plugs right in, so the cord is living inside of the quick release, so then it's basically, it feels like it's wireless, you know? Thank you. But there's different solutions for different whatever wheelbase you put it on. Some you just probably have to use the coiled one. Like normal. HBO come on that thing? Let's see what place I'm in. Um... I can't tell. <laughs> Overall standings. Attach it to your G27? Yeah, with duct tape. Yeah, I'm not, oh, dang it. I'm not entirely sure exactly how it hooks up to all wheelbases. There you go. Trying to catch this guy. Two guys now. Down and give up the time Went in a little 
Dude, go away! <laughs> I think they need to rework the whole slowdown situation. <laughs> I gave up two seconds on a .6 second slowdown. That's crazy. I hate slowdowns. I should just stop getting them. Oh well. I guess we won't catch him. I <laughs> know, Drift Nick, it's so stupid. It could be dash, huh? Hey, I'm happy with fifth, though. Oh, I lose I rating in fifth? Ah, oh, dang it. Ow. Yeah, Red Bull, you can pick, pick up a lot of off tracks. I just feel like certain tracks, the off tracks are inconsistent. Like, just make it the white line, man. Four tires off the white line. Or if you want to go with the geocentric center of the car, like... I don't particularly like that, but... It's hard to know sometimes. But either one, just, just pick something and stick to it, you know? Then they started changing the rules on certain corners. It's just like, what the hell's going on here? I think it should be four tires off the white line. It's an off track. So yeah, you can grip it like this with your thumbs inside, but this pad right here is pretty comfortable, but it kind of feels a little weird. Maybe I'll try it for a couple laps, try to keep my thumbs here. It's a comfy little angle. Yeah, it feels kind of weird when I'm turning though. I don't like it. Go back to normal. Clear on the left. Oh, please. It's not that way anymore, Tokyo. There's like safe. There's that blue line again. There's like safeguards now they put in. Like when you get in a big wreck, it doesn't throw you like it used to. I mean, I'm not scared of it. Pick a line chain. <laughs> there was a slower car. What do you want me to do? I'm just kidding, bro. Um, do I push or pull? I'm a, I'm a pusher. I think he wants you to pick a lane. I'm a pusher. <sighs> or not fucking lose it. God damn it. Can't believe it. Explicit believe soul, it. you made it. What's up, buddy? Yeah, but this is why I don't talk during races. Yeah, that blue line would show up again. I wonder what that is for. You a shower or a grower?
can't imagine pulling the wheel towards me while you're turning or when you're racing. That feels really weird. Yeah, I push. I'm using way too much force. You gotta try to really relax yourself and just use as little effort as possible. time I've ever almost gotten hurt with a direct drive wheel I was horsing around <laughs> you know but in normal operating Clear. procedures it's not you're not gonna get hurt Clear. every time I've ever gotten hurt in like real life it's always because I was horsing around <laughs> hey quit horsing around <laughs> no, oh, good. A group of faster cars approaching. You're skipping work to watch one this? Left. One more left to go. I wouldn't Left's recommend side. that. Clear. You're holding a, a raw egg, Left don't crack it. Or a baby bird. Clear. Oh, little baby bird! <laughs> Dead. Sorry, I had to make a corner. Right side. Clear. I have a problem, like, tightening my shoulders and just tensing up. Oh, it's white flag. You know, you need to learn how to relax your shoulders and tough though like you can do it in practice but if you're fighting for fifth place just to lose three I rating in a in a race you know uh, you start tensing up again like you really only want to exert you want to exert the minimum amount of energy force just to turn the wheel you know That's what I feel like Quirk is really good at. That's, I, I think that's a big reason why Quirk is such a good racer, because he's just so calm and, like, less is more as far as, like, movement. Like, you never see him all, like, tensed up and, like, racing. Like, super hard and, like, sweating. The car in P. One, just the 50.2. is the Bob Ross of sim racing. Yeah, kind of. Well, there you have it, guys. Eh, you know, I actually like this McLaren. I should have drove this thing a long time ago. Give it a shot. I like it. Hey, I lost three I rating, but we had fun. We're trying out the new rim. It's going great. All right, let's check it flag. There's the checkered flag, ladies and gentlemen. Job. You did really well. Eh, I don't know if I'd use the term really well. <laughs> yeah, Casey Kerwin's really good at staying relaxed and just chilling and racing good. Usually when someone's like a super expert at something, they make it look effortlessly, effortless, but it's actually part of the reason why they're good, you know? They say like smooth is fast, you know? Now, what did I set up to be my turkey timeline button on this? Oh, there it is. Alrighty then, your turkey timeline brought to you by Asher Racing. Hey, pick up this rim. It's on sale now. All right. Or don't. I don't care. But it is a sweet rim. Here we go.
Good morning from Norway. Hello. Well, this was a really fun race. Oh, you watched the solar eclipse on YouTube last night. You burned out your monitor. Yeah, but you were part of history, you know? I remember that. I remember void avoiding the number 17 car. guy's got to stop drinking his sponsor. When does the yelling begin? Oh, what a cluster. I'm starting to figure out why I got fifth. <laughs> oh, here's where I made those guys mad. Oh, what is your dream track to race on iRacing? What's my favorite track on iRacing? All right, Bathurst. Yeah, it's Bathurst. This guy's having a heck of a day. You've seen four eclipses and you're only 45? You must live in one of those blue zones. Wait. Oh, I'm sorry. There was some first-time chatters. I gotta start looking at that. Noah with 117. He's a first-time chatter. He's hanging out. Yeah, there's lots of good tracks in iRacing, racing, but I think I like Bathurst the best. Because to me, Bathurst is a great track to race all by yourself like hot lap if you want and it's a great racetrack to actually race on so like best of both worlds oof oof we got problems with that motor BIR is good too yeah alright let's take a look at the results Minus two I rating. There we go. And I lost a little safety rating. It's all uh, all within the parameters. We're fine. <laughs> Look at this scene. I got the wheel on the scene twice. I got a banner, a logo. Man. Crazy. I mean, I could do it again, 15 minute race. <laughs> the weekly challenge race is the Legends Ford 34 Coupe at Sonoma Raceway. <laughs> There's one guy in there like, hey, come on, where is everyone? This is the best ever. M says at Long Beach.
I'm gonna do this again. Or it's not the same race, but. Good run, I was in the 28, nice. Yeah, I'm gonna, I had fun doing that. I'm gonna do the short one now. 15 minute, it's a fixed setup. I may not like the fixed setup over Ryko setup, but we'll see. I guess we'll find out. Mm, no, the Legends car is, uh, how would you describe it? <laughs> it? It's like an old hot rod. It's an old hot rod and they do uh, short ovals with it. But it also does have a decent road setup. Um, like, wee, wee. It's like all made out of like paper mache. Yeah, they are crazy on road. They work on road, but yeah, it's it's different. Yeah. Plug in my phone. Dear Mr. Melon, my PC keeps turning off on me. I was killed in my last race due to the black screen. Am I going to get hashtag banned? <laughs> oh, man. Yeah, probably. Listen. If you read the sporting code, which I do every night, you'll see that on page 17, paragraph C, subsection A, if you have technical difficulties during races, it's completely protestable, and you can get your account taken away from you. Uh, you need to go buy a NASA computer immediately so you can resolve any issues that you may have. Sorry. You wanted to be in the big leagues. This is it. Oh, this wheel is cool. I was confused. Okay. Can you see what's happening on the rim? Not really. So I'm assuming the pit speed limiter is on because it's flashing pit speed limit in red and then the button that controls the pit speed limiter button is flashing red. So I'm like, oh, I'm good. But no, it's telling me it's blinking red because it knows I'm in the pits and I'm currently under scrutiny when it comes to the pit speed limit. So it's telling me, hey, push the limiter, idiot. So I push it, then it turns green that means green green is a good color. Green the color green means you're doing something right. So there you go. Oh, then it went to red green. Oh, okay. Damn, dude. Pretty cool. Oh, this is a great scene. <laughs> what if you're colorblind? I don't know what to tell you. The ambassador has spoken. There's a really small town near me. And it's super small. We're probably talking hundreds of people live there. There is a town near me. The population, maybe 300 people. And by golly, they got approved to build a brand new library. So they're like, oh, you got to go out there and look at the soil because they're ready to build it up, you know? I'm like, oh, okay. 
And I'm like, oh, there's big booming town full of hundreds of people and they're gonna build a library. <laughs> it's like smaller than a house. <laughs> My god, boy. It's, it's just kind of funny. Our library is better. It may be bigger, yeah. But the problem is it's got like bad soil and you know I'm like oh no like whenever I do a job for where there's like government funds involved I'm like oh great they're not gonna want to spend any money to do it right you know <laughs> it's probably one of those situations but they actually they've been trying to get this library built since 2019 they just had, and they redesigned it so it was cheaper, probably smaller. They made the parking lot smaller. They've been trying to do it since 2019 and they finally got approval on it. It's crazy because like, I mean, you know, libraries are good to have, you know, but I mean, it's a super small town and there's surrounding towns, you know? But then I go to other jobs and like, they're spending millions of dollars per day, <laughs> you know, and this job's like, whoa, uh, we finally scrapped up enough money, five years, be able to build a library, like a shed with a patio. Oh, here's your parking. It's like, it's like, you ever see those free libraries and like people put like a little, uh, like a almost like a big birdhouse out in front of their house and uh it's like free books that's basically what it's turned into now. <laughs> you have to calculate the weight of the books in in the specs actually i did a big library years ago and uh yeah, the uh, specifications for uh, building a library are much higher because all the weight of the books, it's a big deal. So, like, the soil has to be stronger, the floor slab has to be thicker, and I never really thought of that, but they're like, yeah, uh, books are very heavy. <laughs> like, yes, this makes sense. What are books? <laughs> so. Whoa, Bruce Almighty subscribed. 15 months that was an hour ago i didn't even see it i don't think i saw that dang it thanks bruce almighty one hour ago okay got it we're all caught up <laughs> hey there he is sorry man i'm glad you're still here i'm sorry just yell at me if i miss it <laughs> dang it i like your username too bruce almighty You have boxes of books? Oh no, X-Wolf. I know, I hope we never move out of this house because Samantha buys books like every day. I had to build her a freaking library just for it. This building is spec to 10,000 books. Not one more book. You bring a magazine in here and the whole thing's crumbling. <laughs> but I just picked up this pamphlet from, from my local doctor's office about skin skin cancer oh you bring that in here the whole thing's coming down that's stupid we actually go to the library that i worked at years ago it's, it's a nice library it's like two-story you know that's another reason but i use uh race labs for overlays Oh, not really. I have this. <laughs> Fucking hell. Ow, my neck hurts. This is my uh, back cam. I should probably get a better one. I don't know. This one's maybe kind of played out. Maybe I should put this... If I put this camera up on that shelf, maybe, and like have it point down, and then like zoom in. The problem is... The problem is with the Elgato face cam, there's no focus on it. Um, yeah, my head's a little low, huh? Hold on, let me fix that. 
There we go. Um, look, eventually, maybe, probably not, but I should probably get like a... You have to have like a super high-end camera to be able to focus well on on a computer screen. You know what I'm saying? Like if you point any old camera at a computer screen, it looks fuzzy. You know? And that's my problem. I, I, like a, a top cam for me has never worked. That's why I put that one like super far away because I'm like, eh, whatever. Like whenever I watch other streams, they have... Sometimes their stream is a... They don't even use a game capture. They just point a camera at the screen. I'm like, how do they get it to look so good? I don't fucking know. <laughs> no, I didn't, Laughing Donkey. Want me to do that? I'll hurry. I'll do one lap of quality, then I'll do it for you. library just has family bathrooms there's uh two bathrooms right next to each other and they're both family bathrooms you know it's the best way to make everyone happy probably depends on your building though didn't you have a screen capture oh yeah you want this one hold on uh, there we go. Hey, wait a minute. I thought this stream was sponsored by Asher. Your library has a toilet in it? That's good. Yeah, this is my entire uh, widescreen. This is my FOV. Green flag, green flag. Except for mine is curved. <laughs> now, if you're watching this... Wait, no, that wouldn't make sense. Never mind. If you were watching this on a curved screen, you went full screen, then it'd be the same? No, it wouldn't. So what people have done, there's YouTube videos on it. So they basically do this with triples, a single monitor, triples, and ultra wide, and they put them all like they stack them all up, you know, so you can see what you're missing, what you're what you're not seeing with the different variations. Still don't know why the wheel goes blue for a minute sometimes. off the music oh my f1's way over there ah the forte one's probably the same so how am i gonna do this
Thatcher one definitely sounds... It's more like... Solid, more like dampened. Yeah, the Ace Tech's more like plasticky. These are like metal. Oh, yeah. You're welcome. Oh, GSI one. Hold on. Oh! I don't remember him being that loud. See the buttons? How they're like the whole thing kind of illuminates and there'll be light like everywhere. With these button caps. Ah, well. I guess, I guess it doesn't make sense. <laughs> well, they're completely covered and only the symbol, only the symbol is lit. You know what I'm saying? So that's. It is pretty nice touch. I'll go, uh... Yeah, you can't tell, because... Camera sucks, but... I'll have to figure that out. But, yeah. You know what would be really cool? Maybe someday it'll happen. I don't know how I would do it. But this whole wall of rims, if I somehow, and it, I guess I could do it, I could run power, because this is a closet here. So what I could do is run USB power to all of these rims, possibly. Oh, well, I guess, how would I do that with the Ace Attack? I guess I wouldn't be able to. And then have them all, like, on? That would be sick, dude. Like the Joe Rogan one where they're all like powered on, you know? I guess if they had a screen it'd be cool, but Oh, who hasn't seen the Joe Rogan rig video? I saw that on TikTok and Instagram way a long time ago. Upgrade your keyboard stand? Dude, my keyboard stand has been with me for years, okay? It's perfect. There's nothing wrong with my keyboard stand, okay? It's a... It's perfect. <sighs> All right. Build a frame for your wheel wall and light them up with LEDs. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I wish there was a light on them. I was thinking about... Yeah, I was thinking about different solutions for that. I don't know, JDM. It seems random. I don't know. Five cars left to grid. Place your bets. Yeah, Peter Pumpkin Eater. I got it up there. Can you see it in this? No. Yeah, I got it. Yeah, definitely. I'll never let that thing go. It's all broken, the top of it. We call it floppy now. It broke. I think it's a faster sector, so it turns blue. Wait a minute. You're saying when I hit, if I achieve a fast sector in the time delta, my thing turns blue to let me know that that was my quickest sector of the race? That would be cool. Waiting on the final carved grid. It should be purple, though. 
I put a TV dinner tray table under my table to hold stuff. So don't be hating that. Uh-oh. We're good, we're good. The wheel's freaking out. <laughs> right, turn it, taking it off and on. Right, having issues. That was weird. <laughs> All right, starting 14th, yikes. You guys betting top five, you're crazy. Yeah, let's get a top five. Get ready, going green. Both car is off, time to do your job. Trust lobby. Is he pitting? No. Three wide. You're in the middle. Three wide. Clear. Two wide. Still there. You're in the top 10. Still there. Clear on the left. Is real tight on him there. I don't know. <laughs> it's tough. Close racing. <laughs> Yee! Should have cut in more to the inside. I think he had a car on his outside. Oh, the car feels fine. have a damage report on this wheel you have damage to various places on your car I don't feel any damage <laughs> I'm lucky to be alive man you got a fanatic ad on my channel <laughs> man they're desperate <laughs> oh, 
Okay, well, we're still in this. There's a lot of cars, a lot of cars in front of me. Slow car ahead. There's an infinite ahead. Slow car ahead. Go left. Hold it together, boy. Ah. Oh, we're about to get some overtakes, boys. Or avoid spinning cars, one of the two. You got a slow car on the left. Oh, yeah. Freebies galore. These guys' car number is 1617, and they're in 16th and 17th. Huh. I guess not after the lap, but... Oh. I was gonna run him over there. We can get a top 10, maybe. That's a short race. Really got to get on it. All right. All right, that was my fat. That was a fast sector, guys, apparently. Yeah, it was. Okay, I think I confirmed it. That sector was green. You got a slow car on the right. There's an incident ahead. Car right. Clear. Not listening to my spotter. Perfect. Go to the inside here. Right side. Perfect. Still there. Hold your line. Clear. Got it. <laughs> Excuse me. Coming through. Time to plant a ship, man. Have a little damage. I prefer a little oversteer, yeah. Come on, baby. Top 10's right in front of us.
The unit of currency is freedoms. Yeah. I don't know why. Attack Invicta Pedals S-Series inverted with the Forte pedal plates. How was that a 4X? I'm saying, man. Yeah, they shouldn't pick that at all. They look I think like we this. should forever have this baby ready to do them. Kind of. Oh, issues behind me. Four minutes. The leader is running. Fifty one point four eight one. You better pit to fix that damage. What if you get a free reset in this? Oh, yeah, you do. Interesting. I've never tried that HE Ultimates before. used to have the Hussingville Pros. This is before they came out with the sprints. And they were good. They were squeaky. Sorry, much being froze. Oh, that could be a slowdown for 21. And then I had the VRS pedals, which were really nice. two stages. It takes some getting used to, for sure, though. That's the most horrendous blocking I've ever seen. Clear on the left. Let it drive. Stay on the right. Still there, hold your line. Keep to the right. 
This is a gaggle. Keep to the right. Fucking here, dude. Clear. Piss off, buddy. Oh, you suck, man. You suck. Left side. Still there. Hold your line. Still there. You don't even There's deserve to be behind. Clear. Nice job, dude. Oh. Okay, buddy. Have fun. That was really bad, Malone. <laughs> Zero X. Yes. Hey, it's tough out there. <laughs> Woo. Minus eleven. <laughs> The oh over. man, that was interesting. Great job, you did really well. Was it worth it to lose my A license over? No. Only 7x. Top 10, what'd I tell you? Yeah, guys, fun all you got a mic? The Skags guy dropped to 14th? <laughs> what a scallywag. That was fun. Not one to show the children. <laughs> hey, you know, it's tough out there. Take a look. I was a little beat up. I, cr I had a big crash, but it didn't really affect me. There's this lap. The first wreck. Quite gaggly throughout the whole race. <sighs> yeah, I'm, I need to be, I need to give him more room. Yeah, that's on me. 
That one's on me. It's on me there. Do that second to last lap. Wait. Wait, was that it we just saw? It? Oh, really, Pierre? Oh, I'm most of the time I'm at fault. This guy, this guy didn't give me any room. That's how it felt. Yeah, he pushed me off a little. This is great, though. <laughs> yeah, this is Scallywags. I'm sending it. He missed the corner anyway. It's totally legit. I gave him a little bump there at the end. <laughs> Any Long Beach? Possibly. Not today, probably, though. This guy just passes me easily. <laughs> What's the worst looking back end in iRacing? I don't know. Take your pick. Well, I'm getting a little cheeky. This was bad. This was really bad by me. I didn't give him any room. Oh, that yeah, was perfect. I'd be so pissed if I was him, though. Because usually, like, oh, well, if I don't come to a... Com Tomas, thanks for the sub, man. Like, oh, if I don't come to a complete stop, uh, you're going to crash us. Eh, I don't know. I guess I've had it both ways. I guess I've had it both ways there. I mean, it's kind of a slide job. It's... I don't, I don't like it. <laughs> They're wrecking back here. This was you in the Porsche? Oh, no. Okay, so Pierre, a.k.a. Bread and Water, a.k.a. Pierre Panagou, a.k.a. Pierre 007, in the Porsche, in the chat. Just gets ass-packed. Man, that sucks. That guy was meter driving, that's why, eh? Guy was meter driving. Zero regard for human safety. Zero regard for human safety. The Human Torch was denied a bank loan. Unique New York. Unique New York. 
Do I have to work tomorrow? I uh, actually don't think I do. I don't know. Not for sure. I don't know. I don't think so. Excellent. Excellente. Muy bien. Ew, nah, ooh, yikes. Oy. Lost a little stuff. Wanna get Portillo's tomorrow? No. Oh no, what is this? It's full Sebring? Why didn't anybody tell me about this? Uh, yeah, we're doing it. There you go, Pete. Tune in next week to see which subscriber Malone takes out next. What? Who did I take out? I had a great race with everybody. Um... I think there, somebody told me there's a way to do this within SimHub, but. Yeah, let's try it actually. So if I go here, I go to devices, this. Car mm -hmm. settings? Run. No. Let's see here. Devices. Uh, this. Uh, um, hmm. Oh, add a car playlist. Yes, that's what we want to do. Excuse me. Excuse me. So wait, will it just work now? Try it. Daniel Gray! Good day, mate! Hello. Hello. Hey, we're checking out the... Uh... How you guys doing? My name's Matt Malone. I stream iRacing. Uh, there's a button I need to push. Uh, oh, there we, there we go. Wow. These are like 480p graphics we're dealing with here. We're taking a look at the brand new. Oh, here it is. I'll just use this. Here we go. Brand new Asher McLaren GT4 Artura Pro Sport USB Ultimate Rim. You guys going to buy it? No? All right. Just letting you know about it. All right, let's see if this works. Okay, it didn't work. That's great. So, what we're going to do is... Somebody told me that worked. Is it free? Yes. No. If you buy it, it's free. Huh? Daniel Gray. Thanks, buddy. I appreciate it. If you guys don't follow or sub to Daniel Gray, you should. He's a jolly old chap. So you go to setups. Trust me on this. iRacing setups. Go to the McLaren. GT4. Controls. I'm going to copy. Paste. Now I'm going to change the name to uh, Ultimate Asher. Now I'm going to put this on my desktop. I'm sure there's a much easier way to do this. Okay, so then I got this loaded. Now I'm going to drag this. Oh, for fuck's sakes, what the hell happened? Hold on. Toyota. Okay, now I'm going to drag this over to here. And then, uh, I don't know, 
know, pick one of these, doesn't matter. Okay, perfect. Close, join. See if it works. There's, oh, yeah. It's a good looking rim. It's probably, you know, for F1 style rim, it is very aesthetically pleasing. It really is, especially with the button caps, the way they're designed with the light shining through just the symbol on the button cap, nothing else. With the screen and the knobs, it's all very balanced. It is very beautiful. Do you need a screen on your wheel? No? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, this is, we're just doing a sponsored stream for like five streams for the new wheel with Asher. Ace Attack's cool with it because it comes with an Ace Attack, uh, comes with an Ace Attack, uh, sweet, all seamless quick release. There's no, there's no cords or anything. It's all within, it's all within the quick release. It's pretty cool. All right, it's working. Oh so, yeah. We get car salesman. Well, listen guys, here's, here's my thing. I'm an old man. I'm 40 years old. I've been sim racing for over 10 years. If I'm going to deal if I'm going to accept deals from these companies, I'm going to make sure it's the high-end shit cuz that's what I want to use. And I'm like, "Damn, this is awesome. Yeah, I want it." But like, yeah, of course it's amazing. <laughs> like makes it a lot easier on myself than I have to be like, "Well, it's great for the money." Well, yeah, this is really good for this price point. Or, wow, yeah, this piece of shit, piece of plastic for $10 is really great for, for $10, you know? <laughs> but when it's, like, super high-end stuff, I'm like, this thing's badass. And you're like, and then chat's like, yeah, but it's $1,600. I'm like, yeah, I know, but it's awesome. Like, what do you want from me? <laughs> you know, it's, e it's easy. I'm not trying to sell it to you, but it's easy to enjoy and use and talk about equipment that's really high-end. Am I wrong? Wait, you're only 40? Damn, you could pass for 39. All right, you son of a gun. <sighs> Be right back. <laughs> hey, Coach Malone here. I, uh, I'm just so proud of you guys. <laughs> I knew we could get the PPPPPP program to work if we just believed. And you guys believed it. You guys reached deep. You guys really reached deep. You made it happen, okay? Now, now, I am, I'm just so proud of you guys. I, I really am. I mean, I mean, who could have seen it coming? You know, I mean, you guys, you guys started with nothing, okay? And you dug deep. You dug deep. You got out there and put a head on somebody. And now we're living in dreamland. We're living in the P P P P P P P P P P program party party plan, and we're living the dream, aren't we? It's because of your hard work and dedication that really made it happen. Okay, 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 okay. You know what I'm saying? But it was fun to, uh, I like doing the, uh, I tried out the Moza R9 and the Thrustmaster T818. And that helps me appreciate the Ace Attack stuff, the Asher stuff, like the higher end stuff. You know what I'm saying? Cause there is a diff, there's a big difference.
Does the wheel make you faster? No. You look cool going slow, though. Quite a bit, Thunder Race. <laughs> yeah. Oh, I had another raid? No way. Hey, Steel Horse Live, what's up, man? Oh, I was, I, I was, uh... I was, I was, I, w I went for a tinkle. Steel Horse Live, good to see you, man. Hope the stream went well. If you guys like uh, Oval, go check out Steel Horse Live. OG. Hope you had a good stream. Checking out a new rim today. From Asher. Can see over the hood here. Wait, you think you'll even get a lap in for Quali? Probably one lap. Is the screen worth it over the Pro? I, I don't know. Do you look at the screen very much? I don't know. I know a lot of, uh, not a lot of people, but I've heard what people do is they will, um, they'll get the pro version, the, the steering wheel that doesn't have the screen, and then they'll get like an Asher sim screen, and they'll put that up further closer to the, 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 the monitor, right? Because with a screen on the wheel, you're like looking at that. But you should be looking at the, looking at the track, you know, the road. You're like, oh, what gear am I in? Oh, I don't know. Let me look down at my screen. Just depends on how you want to experience sim racing. There's no screen in real cars, you know, not a lot of them. Mailware Bites says that Asher site has a Trojan. Beware. I think Mailware Bites is the Trojan. No, I have no idea. I don't know what the price difference between the Pro and the Ultimate is. So. Hey, Pierre. Yeah, it's good stuff, man. Okay, he comes the first time black. Jeff Kent's 59, been sim racing for 30 years. Look at that. Never gets old. I'm pretty tired. I think I'll go home now. I think this will be my last race. Hi, Jenny. When are they going to make a Forrest Gump 2? Remaking Twister. They can remake Forrest Gump. No, you can't read. No, you can't do it. They should remake Titanic where Jack lives. Pushes the broad out into the freaking ocean. Hey, get out of here. Spoiler! <laughs> ah, these RGB lights are giving me epilepsy. Forrest Gump 2 Revenge of the Shrimp. Coming this summer to a streaming service near you. We didn't think Forrest Gump 1 was long enough. 
Forrest Gump 2 has a runtime of over four and a half hours. Boring as hell. Part of the movie is just him running an entire marathon. I do have a day job. I work in construction. But I don't build or I don't build anything. I watch people do stuff. And then slow slow them down by offering suggestions. <laughs> Today I took some soil samples. Yeah, I test like concrete, asphalt, soil. Talk to people. Give recommendations. Work in a laboratory. I don't have a white coat though. To get one. If you're if you're if you're doing if you're building anything structural meaning a building parking lot anything like that I'm your guy I can help you out when you're like digging the hole you know do I ever grunt Ugh. All the time. Comes with old age. Dude, it's funny when uh, we go to the YMCA. Anytime I can. Try to in the morning, you know. But I don't have to work early or whatever. But uh, it's funny, dude, because it's just a bunch of old men. And you're all in the locker room. And everyone's just like, ugh. And then you hear somebody else like, Ugh, like everyone's just like grunting just like old men grunts like somebody gets up and they're like ah like oof <laughs> just constant <laughs> i can't help you with no ground squirrels they're undermining their kitchen where's jimmy hoffa no. I've seen a lot of holes be dug. Never found them. <laughs> J Tringer. <laughs> How much would it cost to add a 20 foot by 20 foot cement driveway? Pure cement? Or concrete. Come on. I have no idea. Are you gonna prep it? Probably like 10k. Cement is an ingredient in concrete. Come on. How do you make concrete? You mix gravel, stone, Sand, water, and cement. Cement's a powder. Come on, you knew that. You probably already knew that. Maybe you didn't. I don't know. All right, race fans, here we go. How are you? Good to see you. Oh, man. When I saw this combo, I clicked register immediately. It's the Toyota GR86 at Sebring. Full. At night. Let's go. Can you help me build my empire? In March 2025 at the Bathurst 12 hour, can you add it to your calendar and book your flights, please? I need your expert advice. I can't help you. I'll be home racing the race. I poured a bag of cement to make a fence a few years ago.
Hey, what about limestone? Some quarries have it's a limestone quarry. Yeah, you make gravel out of it, sure. It's weaving all over the place. We got a weaver. Cement? Cement. I, I call it cement. Hillbillies, uh, like some people call it cement. But if you see a concrete truck, you know those big trucks with the big cylinder, big drum that hold concrete? If you call that a cement truck, a big no no. Concrete truck. Number 57 or Crusher Run. Talking about stone. We don't use that in our area. We call it like CA6, CA7. CA6 is just like road stone. CA7 is road stone, but without the fines in it. It's just the straight chips. Free draining stone. I like me a good four inch minus though. Longest That'll bridge it. How much I don't know how much stuff costs, guys. I don't know. I don't I don't pay for anything. I have no idea. I don't know how much stuff costs. To be or not to be. Get some good three inch stone. Three inch stone, no fines. Meant for like bridging stuff. You got like, uh, if something's really soft and, you know, you gotta build, you gotta build it up, but it's just shit soil. So you're like, ah, put in a couple feet of three inch stone. There's your platform. Build off of that. No, I don't get free anything. Oh my god. No. <laughs> no. <laughs> Why don't the drilling rigs call it concreting the hole? Because they use cement for clean cracks and stuff. <sighs> no. All right, here we go. Yeah, chili nips. All I know is that when I show up onto the site, everyone's going to be spending more money to get the job done. Real fun situation to be in. Yeah, everyone likes a good hoe. Alright, guys, here we go. Could be interesting. We're still checking out the new Asher rim. Oh, good. Green flag, green flag. Here we go. Car on. Still there. Keep to the left. Whoa, this guy's like rubber banding. Clear on the rock. The draft track, let's go. The leader's trying to check out. This guy's paint job is like camo. What kind of environment would you need to be in where that orange and gray would be camo? It's like a sunset camo in a field. I 
in a volcano. <laughs> Works for tigers, it's true. Oh, the leader's checking out. Don't let him. Ah. Matt Friedman leading number one car. Oh, he must get a slowdown. Oh, turn. Uh-oh. Guy's gonna fan me. He's gonna fan you. Who's gonna push me? No, no, he bamboozled me. Still there. Bottom off, guys. You're a Thanks. pipe layer for 20 years, water, storm, and sewer? Damn. Sorry about that, man. Getting left in space. Can we be in space? That's a dangerous job. Watch the replay. Uh, Jeff. Not a joke. Down in holes, big trench boxes and stuff. Wired Orange says, I lay pipe too. Oh, sure you do. Got any proof? That was rolled over. That was a rollover risk. Wreck behind me. The bottom of the ocean, you're laying pipe for the internet? That's where my internet is right now, at the bottom of the ocean. Oh, I gotta catch up. I gotta catch up. Your internet's in the space? I think I caught back up. Just enough to get in a little bit of draft, you know what I'm saying? Hard to see this guy with his camo. So I think the best we can do here is second, which I'm fine with. Stay off them curbs, you know? 
Man, it's really dark at night, you know? Yes. <laughs> Is it too late for a chicken salad sandwich? Well, where do you live? What's your time zone? Then I need more information. I can't complete this, uh... I can't complete that problem without more information. Woo! Michigan. I'll allow it only if it's an open face sandwich, meaning only you're only allowed to have one piece of bread. Best case scenario is you just take four bites of the chicken salad, just the chicken. Then you're okay. You don't want to have too much bread and all that stuff before bed, you know? Just helping you out. Although, I mean, I don't know what your chicken salad looks like. The way Samantha makes it, my beautiful wife, ex-fiance, is uh, she just uses a little bit of mayo. It's just mostly chicken. It doesn't have a bunch of filler. Like, it, the, the, she doesn't use a bunch of mayonnaise. And she'll just use some spices, you know? So it's, mo it's just like dry chicken. <laughs> but it, it holds together pretty well. But I've seen chicken salad where it's like, 50% mayo. It's like, what is this? So, yeah, no. A dead body in the trunk of the Toyota in front of me. No, dude, he's got a 12 point buck in there. Really, Malone? Really what? Sometimes I'll have some ch chicken salad with some club crackers. Like a dipping situation. Here we go. We're going to pass him. Calm down. She was dead when I found her. Still there, hold your line. Oh, jeez. Still there, hold your line. Clear. Now, don't immediately try to pass me. Otherwise, we'll never, we'll never catch up. He's gonna try to pass me. Oh, good job, buddy. This is great. This is great. This is fun. I like this. I like this car on big draft tracks. <laughs> I don't know why. Do you gain more SR for higher license races? No. Well, sort of, but okay. In the higher licensed series, usually the cars are faster. So, you're completing more corners in a race than you would with a slower car? And your safety rating is like, you know... Corners per incident. 
So in a way, like, yeah, you're doing more corners. So sort of, but not really. What really affects your safety rating is where you are on the ladder. So if, like for me, like I'm always sitting around like A 1.5, A 1.8, and you can rack up the incident points, you're fine, you know? But once you're at like A 3.8, A 4.2, you get a couple incidents in a race, you're gonna lose a lot of safety rating, you know? It is. It's like uh, when you like, uh, you know, it, it's like the more, the better you do, the more that's expected of you. So first thing you want to do is lower the expectations right off the bat. Like when you get a new job, let's say uh, Quiznos, for instance, you don't want to show up guns a blazing first day and, and be super productive because then they're going to expect that, you see. You want to go in, going in real half ass in it. <laughs> you want to do just below bare minimum. No, that's bad advice. I, I don't like that advice. People are always like, or I've used it before, like, minimum wage, minimum effort. It's like, yeah, that's why you're making minimum wage. If you went above and beyond, you could climb the corporate ladder. And before you know it, in five or 10 years, you'll make that 50% per hour raise. I believe in you. Just work. The weekends. The <laughs> I'm gonna pass this guy. Stay on the right. Stay on the right. I'm gonna flip. Clear on the left. <laughs> I think I contradicted myself twice in that whole uh, talk there. You also have to know where, you also have to know like the situation, like you gotta start talking to people in the office, you know, like Did you hear Nancy's been here for 30 years? If you realize there's no place to move up, you know, like, go for the pass Still there Don't push him off Malone, give him room Room given Stay on the left. Stay on the left. Clear oh, the good, rock. good, good, good stuff. I tried to get him. He disappeared. He reappeared. Oh, he's playing mind games with me now. Taking it to the next level. Pulling out the lag switch. Guy's got tactics I've never seen before. <laughs> yeah, Entrap is zero. This guy's disappearing better than the camo guy. <laughs> He's a sleeper. Ah, crap. I feel like they took away some of the strength of the draft in this car. Must be really strong. Uh, slow in, fast out. Come on. Let's 
see what happens here. Oh, did I throw him off just enough? Got me. <laughs> Good race. <laughs> that was close. Great job. You did really well. Uh, it sure did get dark out here. Good race, guys. Good race. That was fun. Let's take a. Let's take a. Let's 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 go to the instant replay footage. Base content very populated. Well, Sebring's not base, but should be. So what do you guys think about this tactic here where I go to the inside? I haven't I haven't activated Spider, but it made him I feel like it changed his course. And I was able to get a run. Like he went to go cut it off, you know? Oh, it was so close. Eh, not that close. He got me. <laughs> Turkey timeline. Here we go. Pretty sure, Adrian. The neon palm trees. Yeah, that leader, man, he just... Oh, no. What? What in the world? Oh, oh, the neon palm trees right there. I see him. Give you space more than just I'm trying to complete that corner. I'm watching the replay right now. I'll check it out. If, I, if it was my mistake... There they are. I'll See him. Like I'm, I'm open to your interpretation of it, but I'm just like, I, I didn't even have the time to complete the corner, going to the left and then to the right. Host a hosted race. Kerplunk. Nah, this is my... It's 1 a.m. for me right now, so... I gotta go to bed. What the? Everyone's touching walls. Is he gonna touch the wall, really? K -k -k clunk K -k 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 clunk Oh, no, here's another one. Oh, jeez. They can't get enough of it. Yeah, I'm still turning it off. <laughs> oh, Didn't the grip roll. Yet. Yeah, it's kind of... I'm watching the, the replay here, but it, you know, wasn't your fault, and I, I don't feel like it was too much of a fault because you were trying to make the corner, and I was not trying to get in the grass. So it's just one of those things that happened. Yeah. But... yeah. Just one of those things, you know? Missing incident. Anyway. Finally, sure Matt sure Malone was... gets some green. <laughs> it's been all damn day. <laughs> Point one seven safety rating, twenty seven I rating. You gotta love it. Finally. Hey, that's a good combo. That's a real good combo.
That's a real good combo. You betcha, explicit. Good stuff. Chicken, sour cream, mayo, grapes, pecans, dill. Giving me a grocery list? I don't appreciate it. Alright. I, I, I almost signed up for Mazda. Now I have to go to bed. <laughs> Are you ready for the future? Yes, yes, mommy. The shifter paddles are really nice, I'd have to say. They're like redesigned. They're nice. Let's see, the Pro... Is eleven twenty nine, so you're, and then the ultimate's fourteen ninety nine. So it's like four hundred bucks difference, four hundred dollar difference difference between getting a screen or not for four hundred dollars. That's a decision I don't have to make, but that that is a tough decision, I guess. Hmm. Yeah, this is what they use in the real car, see? We have, like, way more than what they have. <laughs> we have more functionality than an actual race car driver. Isn't that crazy? If you guys haven't seen it, I got the uh, the Sim Racing Room Tour video. One's super long, one's super short. If you want to see what's going on in here? Have you seen the new cockpit from Fnatic? Oh! I thought I saw it. I didn't get a good look at it, but... Yeah. Yeah, now they're selling cockpits? Well, they gotta sell something to pay off them loans, am I right? 7 a.m. here and Matt needs his bed. Yeah. Yeah, this uh, stream and the next, uh, I'm doing five... Five total Asher Racing sponsored streams. So Saturday, maybe I'll slip another one in somewhere, but yeah. Basically till the end of the month. Checking out the new wheel. And uh, yeah. So make sure you guys are subscribed to the YouTube channel. Follow here on Twitch, all that stuff's free. Just a way for you to be notified of the next time I go live, which will probably be Saturday. Um, yeah. It's April 17th. Well... It's it's totally fine. No, Asher talked to uh, Ace Attack. Listen, yeah, it's it's fine. But there's some things going on. It's all fine though. Your birthday's coming up. Don't go. You just got here. I've been on for six hours. I see you streaming.
Uh, hmm. New webcam. Oh. Rudy Scoo. How do you say it? Rudy Scoo. Rudy. Rudy. Rudy, Rudy Scoo. He's doing Long Beach. I haven't raided him in a while. The last time we tried to find a diamond in the rough on Twitch, it didn't quite exactly work. We were watching from some guy's toilet. He's racing Mazda. Didn't read chat once. Yeah, I'd definitely do that on uh, Saturday, Jonathan, for sure. Yeah, I saw that. And maybe I'll... I mean, with the rain, I don't know. Maybe we'll do a, another stream. I don't know. Probably not, though. We got I, a lot of things going on, so... But, yeah. Raid Ruddy's He's in California, I believe, so he's it's early still for him. But thank you guys so much, man. Thanks for uh, coming, checking out the stream. If you're new here, um, appreciate it. Hope you come back next time. I'm gonna go. Uh, I'm gonna go pass out. You guys are the best. Thanks for all the subs and the resubs. Uh, uh, thanks for donations. Bit of donation earlier. Super chat. Thanks for the viewers on YouTube. What what video comes out tomorrow? Oh, it'll be AMS. Oh god, dude, don't! I reminded myself of AMS. Son of a bitch. It sucks. Yeah, the next time I'll be on is probably Saturday. So unless it changes, I'll let you know in the Discord. So you guys have a wonderful night. If it's super late where you are right now, it's time to go to bed. Listen, we're old. We should be keeping a very normal sleep schedule, okay? None of this staying up past our bedtime, eating candy, and drinking Mountain Dew, okay? Time to be an adult and go to sleep. <laughs> See you guys. Love you. Bye-bye. Well,